Hello everyone, how you doing? Welcome again to UK, welcome to a bit of farming. Um, farming Simulator 22, our server is still up and running even though I haven't streamed it for a while. All the work's been going on in the background, so there might be a few of you that thought, oh, we don't do farming anymore. It's always on the back burner. Unless I say it's gone, it's not gone. And farming sim definitely isn't gone. Now, you know, I always play it on controller, always. In fact, I say I don't want to play it on the racing rig, um, or on the rig, I should say. But obviously, ever since getting the, um, the, the trucking rim, which suits itself to, you know, obviously predominantly trucking, but of course, other vehicles like trucks and... Uh, combine oristers I thought yeah they're set out up on here I've had a very quick go this afternoon and doing it more first person sitting in this position with the truck it's very nice actually it's actually making it feel um, way more sim than just doing it all with the controller so for tonight um, we're using the TSW I've put an extra little camera up there it won't keep switching it will stay like that so it's not in the way as such and if you want to check out any details of the, on this there are links in the description full transparency if you ever brought anything on Moza from those links they would send the channel a small commission but that's just full transparency but yeah how are you everyone so we're going to do a few hours um of farming i think kim is coming into the chat uh she's going to tell us what's changed and we're going to do some grapes as well and uh, apparently she's never done grapes i've certainly never done them so yeah it is a members only server a couple of reasons for that one it's a perk for the members um who support the channel on a monthly basis two we did open to everyone it was a bit of a mess it was a lot of hard work for the farm managers and it was just all a bit it, it was just all a bit noisy so i've made it members only you know it's just one of them things really um it's n there's nothing wrong there's no i'm just doing something here there's nothing um you know it, it's all good it's just a members only stream it does yeah and it feels very immersive as well because it's not like a, a a sim racing you know this is full-size trucking rim so yeah i'm looking forward to tonight actually um You've done grapes, not too hard. Okay, that's all good. Uh, it was carnage. Yeah, it was. And it took him and um, all the other lovely farm managers a, a lot of time to sort everything out. And yeah, so I've just made it members only. It's not the end of the world. Um, you don't have to be a member to watch. And that's what a lot, that's what predominantly most of you come in for. Um, so uh, yeah, it won't affect 99% of you. But yes, if you're a member, you're more than welcome. Girls, I saw your message. Uh, oh, let me just put the new password in the chat for um that's it and we can pin that as well yeah so if you go to the members only um the members only channel on discord you'll see the new password uh right let me get logged in just so i know i'm at least logged in <laughs> we haven't had any i don't think we've had any mods since the last one It should be, it bloody well should be a, a good stream. Well, what's, that's the plan. <laughs> uh, right, let me say some lovely hellos to all you beautiful people that come in and support my channel. I do appreciate it so much. Uh, Steve, we've got Chrissy, hello, Para, Colonel, Thomas, Pug, Sophie. We've got Mortz. Uh, Colonel K, he's there. I said him twice, didn't I? Joseph Adams, the J, the J, J, A. Hello, Kyle. Hello, Mark. <laughs> How are you all? Hello, Chris. Hello, Kim. Hello, Gers. Yeah, Gers, if you go into the uh, the Discord um, channel, the new password will all be loaded. Don't do anything, please. Just while me and Kim have a chat, maybe she'll show us around, just refresh memories, and please don't do anything if you are going to come in um, into the server. Just just wait a bit. I've already given her likes so and no pressure. Yeah, pressure's off now, isn't it? Hello, Mark. How are you? <coughs> so it's still half-term in the UK, so that's why I haven't been streaming that much, but... Um, I'm like New York. Yeah. <laughs> What's so good they named it twice? <laughs> That's it, girls. Yeah, feel free to come in. Yeah, still UK, uh, still um, half term, so I won't be back properly 100% until next week. But I have still been working on the channel. I've been doing the um, Moza videos. I've still got a couple left to do. It's all good. Oh, hello, Linda. How are you? Right, so I'm still going to use controller for, you know, a lot of what I'm doing. The only, the only thing I'm using the uh, steering wheel for is um, it always stutters at this th at the beginning, doesn't it? It's horrible. Yeah, I'll be using the steering wheel for obviously driving the vehicles. Hopefully that stuttering will stop in a second. Yeah, there you go. It's a lovely evening. There's Kim. Well, let's get Kim in the chat, shall we? Let's have a look. Hello, Bex. How are you? How are you? 
So I don't know if Kim's staying in all night. She certainly doesn't have to, but we'll have a little um, a little chat now. And uh, uh, if I call... There we go. We're calling her. We're calling. Hello. Hello. How are you? Can you hear me? Yeah. Just oh, oh, you can hear second. me, yeah. You can. <laughs> That's all right. How are you? Um, I'm all right. I've got a bit of a sore throat. So. Oh, no. Are, are you <laughs> off work or are you at work? Um, I have been. I'm better than I was. Um, but I'm all right. I've got my molly with me, so I'm happy. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Well, as long as you're getting better, that's the main thing, isn't it? Yeah, it's just I, my cough. It's just annoying. So I apologise now. No, no, cough. you're all right. You're all right. <laughs> right, what have we got? Have we got anything different here since the last stream? I know you was working on some stuff. Um. Well, really, the only thing we've got is we put the great factory in. Oh, you got um, a great factory. Yeah, so that's over... Uh, I don't know if you want to just run over or grab yeah, a Yeah, we'll run over. No, we'll run. That's yeah. all right. You've got your car there. Yeah, that's all right. <laughs> um, it's over here. We could just jump there, I suppose. No, nah, let's <clears> run <throat> there. Come on, let's run. We. I okay. need the exercise. Look at the size of me. <laughs> I'm ballooning. <laughs> I am. I can't stop eating. I don't know what's wrong with me. <laughs> Summer's coming. It'll stop then, won't it? Yeah. I'm still in winter hibernation mode. Well, it's about to go winter in here, so... Oh, God. In the farm. Look at the trees. So <laughs> what, do, what do we do with the grape factory? Obviously, we deliver the grapes there. Then, then what, what do we make? Do we make wine or anything like that? <coughs> grape juice. Oh, OK. I think. That makes um, sense. Yeah. I think there's raisins as well. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Para's joining <coughs> All right, Kim, calm down. Sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> <coughs> Hello, Ricky, how are you? How are you, Glenn? Right. Ready when you are? Yeah, sorry, I was just like, uh, grabbing a drink. Yeah, so it's been a little bit busier, <coughs> but it, the, the farm sort of went quiet, didn't it? But then it's um. Yeah, yeah, it it's picked up so a bit. In, yeah, in here, we've got our live factory on this right. Yeah. We've got the great processing unit there, and then we've got the the cereal factory here. Okay, um, so where do we um, where do we drop the grapes off, for example? <coughs> It'll be the great factory one here, but we need raisins as well. Okay, do we grow them? Or? So, well, the ra for the cereal factory, we need the raisins, and for the raisins, we need the grapes. Okay. So there's a whole process. Yeah. Going yeah. on here. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, but then Sweet over and near sour raisins. Yeah. Um, over near we'll have to jump over to it. Um, if you go to field one two four, which is on the right. Oh, hang on. Yeah, one two one one two, uh, one one two four. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and then just jump into one of the vehicles that's there. Can we do that from this screen, or do I have to? How do I do? Yeah, that? if you click on the vehicle. Just click on one of the vehicles. Oh, let me zoom in. They're all on top of each other. Um, so we've got the Rex. We've got the TPN. We've got... And then just the enter board. vehicle. Uh, I haven't got that. Oh, yeah, I've yes, got it. Babe. Yeah, yeah, I've got it. Yeah. <coughs> That's it. And then this is our great field. Oh, cool. Look, look at this first person as well. We're going to be getting a lot more first person. <laughs> I'm always third person in this, always. Never play it third person. So that's going to be quite cool, actually, behind the wheel. Cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah no one start. Oh, no one um, start, please, if that's OK. Yeah, we've um, del deliberately not touched it. Yeah. Um, but this, it's very long. Okay, so it's going right. to be a very long job. That's all right. Oh, we want long ones. That's good. So how do we do it? What, what's the machine? What's the machine? That um, we use? You need um, you need the big one okay. um, that you were in. Yeah. Um, that's the harvester. Yeah. And then that would go. Um, I can show you. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah. Bring it out, and then uh, we can see it in its sort of glory. Mark's in. Hello, Power and Mark in the in the farm. Oh, nice one, uh, sneaky. There 
this synchronizing is bloody horrible. Yeah, it? It, it's got a lot longer, I think. Has it? Because of the mods and yeah, yeah. Just, uh, we've got a lot of equipment. Yeah, yeah. We were <clears throat> debating reducing it down. Um because other than the streams, there's not actually sixteen people in the farm. No, so no, we don't no. technically need that many tractors. Yeah, um, yeah true, yeah. So we could reduce them down. Yeah. Um, so you line it up. Unfold. Oh, oh, look at that. Nice. Uh, You're getting now. nosebleed being that high. <laughs> and then you go over oh, look it at that. so it goes through. Yeah, yeah. Um, and then, yeah, you just carry and, on. And that's filling up like in that. the same sort of harvest yeah, way, yeah. yeah. If, you, if you jump in now and then yeah. carry on. Um, so, um, is there a pipe out system on this, or how do we empty it? <clears throat> well, I'm not sure whether we need a specific trailer because with all the grape stuff, there's a grape trailer. Yeah. And uh, um, from what I've seen on videos, it tips the whole back might tip into it. Oh yeah. Um, so I'm not sure if we actually need to get that specific trailer. Yeah. Or we can just use one of the ones we've already got. We can try it with one of the ones we've got first, and then we'll see afterwards. And you can see it visually as well, because obviously the grapes have disappeared off the bit we've just done, yeah. Le leaving yeah, the um, leaves behind. That's really cool. Yeah, so now what we would need to do is um, we've got to... Do you have to water and um, uh, um, pes pesticide this sort of stuff? Yeah, yeah, but there's a little cutter machine. I'll bring it out. Um, and it'll trim the hedges. Oh, nice. um, it's really cool the way it looks, actually. Yeah. You jump out of the Yeah, I'm going to jump out. Um, oh, I can crush really... a grape. Yeah, all right, Colonel. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're doing the bushes on the outside. Oh, yeah. No, yeah, you are. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you just sort of yeah, reverse so up then, there? So then you just, like with the harvester, you just. Oh, hang on, I misunderstood. Just follow behind. Yeah. yeah. And it kind of trims. The moss, yeah. the, the leaves and that, and then it'll just start regrowing. Hang on, I'm getting as... mixed up. Uh, you're talking about the grape bushes, aren't you? Not the bushes yeah. on the side, because the no, way no, you, the, the way you reversed bushes. up, it just threw me there. I was like, oh, no, look at that. No, oh, I see. Yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's cool. Um, and then, as well as that, we need to mulch and cultivate, or cultivate and mulch. I'm not can't remember which way around it is. The can, grass can on we, the floor. Uh, I was going to say, can we cut the grass on the floor and get money that way? Yeah, we have to. No, we we can't do that with this. Okay. Um, but we'll have to mulch it. Yeah. Um, not e not even with a small uh, grass cutter could, <coughs> could we nick I've that grass? I've never tried that. I mean, it's there. You it's available, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, I'm not sure you'd get a. Yeah, get a lot, um, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. What am I trying to think of? The forager down it. Yeah. You know, to pick it all up. Um, I'll just find the great thing then. Right, shall I start harvesting for a bit then? Yeah, yeah, go for nice. it. Um, okay. In the... <clears throat> for the other fields, we have... <coughs> I just want to see where the actual ridge is. Okay. Um, so field, if you know people want something to do, field 49, which is... Sugar beet, well, that needs harvesting. Just trying to get uh, my bearings on this. It looks like it's this. Yeah, okay, I gotcha. Yeah, it's offset to the wheel. Yeah, the, yeah. The, the thingy bit, isn't it? This You're little red controller to seems to be where it is. Yeah. I think. So, yeah, if you look to the right in, in the cab, you oh. probably see it going through. Yeah, I'm, I'm over sure. a little bit, yeah. That's it, it's there. So let's have a look where it is in the cab. Oh, I can't really see it. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, Should so um, 107 and 54 need the grass cut in. Colonel. Oh. God, they're so rude in the chat, aren't they? <laughs> yeah. I don't know where they get it from. I'm going to snooze. <laughs> Oh, 
luckily there's a mute on this. Oh, oh, <laughs> hang on. Bloody hell. I've put my own back out before sneezing. Oh, I'm not. I'm definitely struggling to find the, the, the groove. Oh, I think I've got it now. Yeah, that's it. That's it. That's the one. Oh, maybe not. Oh, this is cool third person. First person, sorry. With the steering yeah, it wheel. Looks this, good on the, yeah, this is on awesome. The, yeah. <coughs> yeah, yeah, no, I've got it wrong. Okay. I've got it wrong, so it's over a bit more. And about there. Okay. So yeah, we've got two grass fields that need cutting. The sugar beet field, which is uh field forty nine. Yeah, that's better. Um Tree, the trees are actually at the full height, so they can be cut down now. Um, and all the animals need sorting as usual. So we've got quite a bit of work to do. Yeah, and let me just check the contracts because last time there was loads. Of con yeah, there's a ton of contracts. Open. Which we can. Uh, the, there's harvesting ones and uh, grass ones, bailing oh, ones, lovely. but we can only have three at a time of those contracts. Yeah. I don't um, think there's a huge amount of members coming on anyway, is there? Who's coming, yeah. on, who's coming on the farm, members? If I not, think everyone's got... waiting for you to say, come in. No, I have, yeah, only... yeah, no, definitely come in. Yeah, yeah, the password's in the uh, members chat. Yeah, of course, come in. Yeah. Just going to check that, that's all good. Yeah, I think I'm all right on there. It's quite tricky, isn't it? Yeah, um, I just need to go and check something because yeah, of course. there's some noises going on in the background. Right? Yeah, of course. Molly's perks up. So I take it this will be just going up one way and then down the other. Yeah, this is actually surprisingly good on um, on steering wheel. I didn't give it much thought, did I? I was very much like, no, 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 we'll do it, we'll do it controller. Huh, maybe I should try Snow Runner on the, on the steering wheel, shouldn't I? Maybe. I was hoping the old uh, motion platform would support farming sim. I'm surprised it doesn't, but it doesn't. How are you all anyway? Have you had a have you had a good a good week? It's been changeable weather where we are. One minute is bloody summer, then it's winter. What's that volume like as well, by the way? Yeah, this feels like you're way more in control of the um, the vehicle in first person. Because ordinarily, I'd be doing it like this, wouldn't I? And yeah, I'd be showing you the machinery. But this way, I'm sort of... We're in the machinery instead. You finished Skyrim 100% again. Oh, bloody hell. I wish I had that commitment. Still getting snow. Where, where, where do you live then? In the Highlands? Yeah, this is going to take a while actually. Yeah, I'm quite relishing this. You know me. Yeah, uh, if I just get a little bit of the steering wheel graphic over the, uh, the grape bush, that seems to be the sweet spot. Yeah, completely changeable, yeah. Alaska, oh bloody hell, well you get Alaska, you get snow all the time, didn't you? Alaska, wow. What's the time over there? And what's the temperature? How cold is it? Or is it one of them where it's not cold, but you're still getting snow? Oh god. Look how much we've got to do. <laughs> right, I'm bored now. <laughs> no, I'm not. I've got more commitment than that. That's it. 11.28 a.m., right, nice. Oh, here we go. Mortz is coming in. Sorry about that. That's all right. What was on fire? <laughs> <laughs> now, Tally was scratching 
on the stairs. Oh, um, all right. And she was flopping all over the place. She was in that. There's no going near her when she's like that. She'll uh, attack me. <laughs> oh, right. How was she though? But, all right. Yeah, Molly's fine. Yeah. She's been out for a wee as well. So, oh, that's good. Yeah, she's, she's lovely as usual. Yeah, no worries, Mort. To come in, mate. Yeah. I think you'll just. That's it. Sorry, I didn't realise I'd left it in there. No, that's all right. <clears throat> How are you, Power? Mm-hmm. Yeah, this is this is surprisingly surprisingly good of a steering wheel. I never gave it much thought. I was always like, "No, nah, I'll just do it on controller." It just seemed like the best thing, controller. But actually, this is. Um, it looks good. Yeah, it feels like I'm actually more in the. It's, it's way more immersive, obviously. Yeah. But. Yeah, and I don't really do first person much. I'm always third person because I want to sort of show the machinery off, as it were. But actually, being inside the cab, that's pretty cool. I've um, done a bit of 19 on a wheel, but my my wheel is not anything compared to... What have you got? I don't even know what brand it is. It's oh, just yeah. literally, you plug it in. That's the beauty but... of PC, though, isn't it? It doesn't matter it, no, what it, it is. It doesn't work on... Very well. Like I've tried it with the uh, ETS. Yeah. And I end up crashing all over the place. Oh. But I can't adjust anything. That probably just needs fine tuning a bit. It, oh, it's it. just, it's not got any of that on it though. It's yeah. literally just a wheel, and that's yeah. it. Um. <clears throat> so I have had some on my wish list for a while. In, in Why is this steering not working now on controller? It was. Oh, bloody hell. That's a good name. <laughs> well, Max brought the trailer, I think. That's yeah, it. Max just, brought just... a trailer to try it out. Oh, I think I've missed one as well. Yeah, I have missed one. Huh. Have you? Yeah, you've I've got been up. You've been up and then come back down. Yeah, uh, but for some reason, the, the two up from me is... Oh, that's the very first part of the first one. Oh, okay. May- oh, well, maybe I didn't switch it on, actually. Quick enough. Yeah. <laughs> We've all done that. <laughs> yeah, I might, I might get a knob it. on the steering wheel power. Um, uh, sorry, Park. Might do. Be a proper farmer. Yeah, it's on console now, isn't it, Dougie? So what are you doing, Kim? What are you, uh, what are you doing on the old forest? Um, I'm just about je- checking for the crepes in the info bit to see what, tra- <coughs> see. See what trailer we need. Um, no, just to see what we do okay. with... Um, so it says, once grown, harvest your olives or grapes, because you can do olives as well, but they use a different harvester. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> and to, to, also remember to prune your grapes, which is what the orange machine is for. Yeah. Um, you don't realise the work that goes into this stuff, do you, in real life? No. I mean. <laughs> no. You, th- you think, oh, grapes, lovely, easy. Yeah. Um, how how much for a punnet? <laughs> <laughs> Apparently you don't need to prune them for the olives, um, but we also need to, um, f- to gain a full yield, you need to mulch, cultivate and fertilise between the rows. Okay. Which we did do initially when yep. we first put them in. Once the grass is growing high, use the mulcher, so we need the mulcher. Is there a limit on how many productions you can have on a map, Shane's asking? You might know the answer to that. Uh, I don't think so. This map, um, when you first get it, it doesn't actually have all of the productions on it. Can you add to it? Um, <clears throat> yeah, well, that's what we've done. We've yeah. added um, the butter. Oh, I'm full up. Uh, I'm full up. So, Mark did actually bring the tray. I should sure go to the end then, shouldn't I? Yeah, we won't be able to get to you. Yeah. Um, Hello, Lawler. How are you, mate? Did you see my video, Lawler, about getting this working on the Fanatec? I know you were waiting for that video. 
you're not <coughs> waiting for it, but you were interested in that video. Not sure. I'm not sure where Mike's gone. I did see him with a trailer. Oh, he's, he's no you. Uh, do I have to do anything to unload, I wonder? Uh, it's not giving me any options for like unload or tip or anything like that. Even if you kind of side onto the trailer? Maybe if I reverse up onto the trailer then. Yeah, if not, we'll, have, we'll go and get an actual great trailer and see if it does any different. Nah, it's not doing shit. <coughs> right. I'd, I'd say if there's the a proper one, it probably um, connects up somehow, doesn't yeah. it? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's it's not, not working, Mark. It's only got 6,000 litres. It's not that great, big to be honest. Probably get a couple, eh? Yeah, yeah. It's but maybe we might be able to hook them up together. Thanks, Wadey, yeah, that's all Kim and Mark and Para's work, not mine. Yeah, definitely Lola, but yeah. It's members only, um uh Wee Box I'm afraid. I'll wait for you, Mark. Great. Oh no, there is a, there's bigger ones. Once you've harvested the grapes, do the proceeds go into your current account? <laughs> oh god, I just <laughs> read that. Oh shit, I was like, oh, Colonel's got a question, everybody. Little shit. I just got done <laughs> by that. Oh my god. Right, yeah, they do, there's three different sizes for the trailer, so I've got one okay. for now. Um, Yeah, this is, uh, this is cool. I'm going to jump out, save petrol, and I shall wait for you. Where shall I plonk us? Oh. I'm going to go, there you go. That get... Looks, that looks like nice. That's it. <laughs> yeah, hopefully you've left me a little cheeky like. That would be awesome. Hello, Andrew. How are you? <laughs> no, nah, he's already done that one, Lola. You just click the um, the little dollar sign, depending on what device you're on. If not, there's a link in the description in the uh, thing there. If you if you do want to, don't just become a member just for the farm though. <coughs> Hello, Daniel. How are you? Late to the party, yeah, yeah. You got that link there. Depending if you're on Apple, sometimes it doesn't show up, but that link should take you to it. And then if you come into Discord. Um, um, you have to attach your account in Discord to your YouTube account so Discord knows that you're a member. Then you'll see the members room. Then you'll get the login details. <laughs> Why can't I see the members channel? Uh, oh, I don't know, Sneaky. Have you attached your um, Discord account to your YouTube account? I'm on my way with the trailer. Yeah, no worries. Oh, it feels good to be back on the farm, actually. I've got some stuff I need to remember how to do. <coughs> <laughs> yeah, and you've not been on for a while. You're like, where's everything? Where's yeah, it? yeah, definitely. Where's, this going? where's that? Yeah, and, and I didn't like... have I didn't have it down to a T anyway. I mean, I was always <laughs> lost in the bloody farm. I'm not sure, sneaky. Sometimes if your um, sometimes if your membership is almost run out, maybe they do it on a different day of the month. Um, I know Joseph used to get kicked out. Um, but he was still a member here, maybe. I don't know. Yeah, maybe they do it on different days. But, yeah, if you're a member, you should see it. All right, we're just waiting for Kim to come down, which is, I'm guessing that's one there. That's it. Yeah, I'm, sh I'm short cutting through our field. <laughs> <coughs> that's it. I can see you there. We did buy the um, small uh, manure spreader as well for these. Yeah. Um, because it instead of when you use a normal manure spreader, it either comes straight out the back or some of them come out the side. 
this one it kind of just only comes out two little spots at the back okay but at, on each side as oh, well yeah, I so can see it. Yeah, it, yeah, yeah, yeah it would get so it would get the uh, either side of the <clears throat> the grapes oh here we go yeah I've got an unloading thing let me just reverse straight on yeah oh shit I wonder whether I actually got that prompt on my well I one. don't know let me because my Check. steering my steering wheel is covering that text up but yeah hopefully that wasn't you can try it, it also one, I suppose. well it also depends if the actual trailer accepts grapes yeah yeah of course yeah i'm looking at that red one now um, it doesn't so it wouldn't have worked with that little red trailer yeah i can't see the grape symbol yeah so there you yeah. go you got it. Yeah, that's only 21%. I do mark, so yeah, I'll yeah. I'll leave this at the end, bottom of the field. Okay. Uh, which one was it? It's that one. It's not mark. There we go. Oh, let's not forget to turn it on. <laughs> Lovely. <coughs> oh, that's good, Snakey. That's good. Yeah, this is cool. I like these jobs that are not monotonous, but they take a long time and quite fiddly. Yeah, this, yeah, is, this is good. Bit, I like it's this. It's a bit different yeah. than the normal jobs. I've got a Peugeot um, 2008 uh, Mark. I love electric. Yeah, I've got no problem with electric. Right, that one's done. Sometimes it can be a pain you to were find on the, the old. Uh, go on, say again. You were on the third one. Yeah, but I'd, I was only halfway through this. I've done the third one now. Well, I'm going to attempt to prune the bushes and mulch at the same time. Oh, come on. It does like to get stuck. <laughs> Bloody hell, it's fiddly. Maybe if I turn it off, actually. Maybe that might be... It might ease up. So I'm trying to drive backwards. If this one's anything like on, um, is it pure farming? I can't remember which, which one it was, but that has grapes and all that on that one. Yeah. And if you try and this, it's just a yeah. nightmare. That's what this is doing. I might go all the way up, actually. Yeah, I think I am. As a waste of time as that'll be. Yeah. Reversing is a bloody nightmare. It's like it literally just gets stuck. Yeah. Um. That's better. How's that extra little camera, by the way? Not not you, Cam, I'm just asking the stream. Um, that extra little... Well, you can answer if you want to. But that extra little camera, any good? Because I know we were experimenting the other day, was, was, was swapping over. Um, yeah, what do you think? Any use? You can come on, Andrew. Hello, Lee, how are you? That's better. Yeah, we got Kim in tonight. <laughs> you hadn't noticed that. Oh, thanks, Pug. That's nice. Am I entirely sure whether this is actually working? Hello, Sc oh, for f Hello, Scud. How are you? Hand cam. Yeah. No, I like it, Mark. I like it. Yeah. You've got to base it on um, charging mostly at home because that. Oh, for f charging mostly at home because that's the cheapest way to do it. But sometimes it can be awkward trying to charge it, find a charger when you're out. Motorway services are absolutely fine. But um, yeah, we don't have any trouble with it. You learn to adjust, you know. 
really cheap to run though, really quiet, oh. really nice. I'm just going to go oh. back down this first one. Yeah, I'm, I'm just going to say that. Yeah. I've just gone over them with Prima, but they're still there. They're still there. That's fine. <laughs> they're, they're, just, they're just all juiced It doesn't up actually there. look any different. Yeah. Is it with the bit that I've just come over, so I'm not sure. <laughs> just for that view, yeah, maybe. Oh, I'm still not getting the bloody hang of this. Well, I've got the hang of it, it's just trying to... That's it, there, that's it. That seems to be the sweet spot. Trouble is, once it starts to go off, then... Oh, God, I've got to reverse out now. <laughs> Plug in hydro. Oh, lovely, yeah. Right, we went to Chessington yesterday, um, so I charged it last night. Um, used up pretty much all of it. I've got about 50 miles left. Yeah, it was no problem, uh, Mark. Yeah, it's all good. I don't. It, it's that good that I don't even think about it now. It's just the car, you know. And if we know we're going out, we'll charge it the night before. Yeah. Can you turn, it, turn the arms off? I don't think, no, no, you can't. No, no. There's no option for that. It's fine once I get the hang of it and exactly where it's got to be. I love playing it with a steering wheel now, though. I think I'm fully converted. Right, here we go. Let's try it now. So, yeah, that looks about right. There, that's perfect there. So if we go for the steering wheel just a little bit into the graphics of the of the great vine, that should be fine. I think if because um, some people do do this all like first person. Yeah. I think it's all like learning where. Yes. Obviously, yeah. where you need to go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. By yeah. being inside the the, the cab, you know. Um, because I've tried it first person and then I just, I always just be like... Yeah, third person is definitely easier. Yeah. 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 It's weird, my steering wheel stopped, my controller steering wheel stopped steering. Oh no, no, it's come back now. Only a little bit. I think they're inter uh, interfering with each other. But that's fine, I only want to use the actual steering wheel. It's really good, Lawler. Yeah, it's changed the game for me. It feels way more simmy. Yeah, and it's encouraging me to do, obviously, first person. The mockery, yeah, I was going to get the mockery. I, in fact, I ordered a mockery, a mockery, mockery, a mocker e, um, but that was when there was a chip shortage. So we put a deposit down, uh, and they just kept like, oh, it's not ready yet, it's not ready. I was going to buy a new one, and then in the end, I bought a, a year old 2008. Yeah, it was alright. I've had quite a few Vauxhalls now. I'm off a of Vauxhall. Look at Peugeot. You, they're actually really nice cars. Yeah, way better than they used to be. And I think they're Vauxhall as well, aren't they? <coughs> and they all share my, the same engine anyway. My first car was a Peugeot 206. Oh, yeah. I loved, I loved it. Yeah, yeah. my wife had a 20, yeah, 206, yeah. Yeah. Caused me a lot of problems, but... Broke down outside Old, old Trafford once, so that <laughs> was great. Literally on the, the big roundabout that's oh, there. Right. Yeah. And oh, it was horrible. It was rush hour. Did everyone boo? <laughs> <laughs> I was booing because <laughs> um, it's not the side of town I would have wanted to be on um, but where I'd broken down I was actually blocking the the bus lane kind of goes oh, off shit. on its own yeah. Yeah. Um, so I was blocking that Yeah. and then obviously a few people were like beeping me and that and I'm like well I can't you, move you can't my car it. Yeah. yeah. Um, but these two very nice uh, blokes in a white van yeah. um, kind of came up behind the car before he'd even stopped his van his passenger jumped out he's like do you want us to move your car love and I'm like yes please <laughs> <laughs> so he put me there was like a lay by in the bus lane yeah put you in there um, and he put me in there and that was like the safest place I could be yeah because um, it was a main road as well um, so the buses could still get past and I was just there so I was sat there waiting for Chris because Chris wasn't that far behind me. Right. Um, I think we ended up eating KFC, <laughs> waiting <laughs> for the recovery car. <laughs> <laughs>
Oh, who's in? Yeah, she, We've started yeah, she's, as Andrew. Uh, she's saying she remembers that day and I was very uh, peed off. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Melody. Um, how are you? What do you drive now? Um, now it's a Ford B Max. A Ford, um, what, sorry? A B Max. Oh, B Max, yeah, I know, yeah. 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 Um, I've had a bit of issues with that as well, but. Uh, you know, it's all I could get yeah. short notice right. when I needed a car, so because my mini obviously got took off me by he must mm. not be named, so let's not go there. <laughs> I appreciate that, appreciate that, Lee. Yeah, I will do. I will do. We always end up in North Wales for some for some reason. I don't know why? Yeah, we should do South Wales. South Wales is really nice. Yeah. Like North Wales is only like an, like an hour away for us, really. Yeah, of course it is. Yeah. Get yeah. in there. Yeah. Um, so we can do like day trips there and that, which yeah. is great. Oh, I love that. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, we love South Wales. Done many holidays down there. I think we did yeah, a we... Crystal Maze there once when we were kids. You missed <laughs> a bit of the grapes. What? Yeah, <laughs> I can literally see like one bit that's still there. Oh, okay, I'll get that on the way back up. Are you going to empty me at the top of this field? I think. Um, Mark's waiting in the tra in the trap to. Oh, okay, for you. yeah, yeah. Do you want him to come up that end, or are you coming back down to the shed? I'm going to. Yeah, I'm up on the shed. Yeah, I'm coming towards the shed. Okay, is that? I think I just need to do about five <laughs> miles an hour and then I can um, control it better. Yeah. Is that camera meant to be working on the first person view? It doesn't really on this, does it? Is this a mod thing or is this a real um, in game thing? This is in game. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, I think originally in. Did they bring it into 19? I really can't remember if the. It was a DLC in 19, but it's it's obviously base game because we've got no DLCs on this one. Yeah, have we? yeah. So, um, the only thing I find with the doing grapes because I've I've done a bit of grapes, but I've never harvested them. Yeah, is whenever I'm going up and down the rows, I always get stuck on the the wood. Yes, that's what that's what's happening. But I'm... I'm... Yeah. Just trying to guide it in between this orange little um, joystick and the right hand side of the steering wheel. That seems to be the sweet spot there. Cool. Oh, this is cool. And it's going to take me hours as well, which, is, which I love. And yeah, that's the only thing with um, grape farming is you can't put it on a AI. Yeah. yeah. Which in our case is fine because we don't do that anyway. No. Nah. <clears throat> but I think that's probably why I've not really done it on my own farms. It honestly feels completely different at the rig on the steering wheel. It's really weird. I think I'm going to have to try SnowRunner like this, you know. But that'll be ace. Yeah, I've always said, and I think SnowRunner, I think it works on the motion platform as well. I think, I'm not sure. Yeah. There's another new um, season coming out. Yeah. It's really weird how I haven't had, and there's, there's no, there's no fault of the game, but I haven't had any inclination to go back to um, uh, uh, the new snow run. Yeah, the expeditions. I, I just haven't had an inclination in my mind to go back for it. At a, oh, I was going to do the bloody <coughs> MTM, wasn't I? It, 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 it's weird. I wonder whether, because it's not an easy ride in um, expeditions, is it? It's not. It's not easy. You're always being tested it's always a tricky ride i've not bought it yet yeah it's um, weird <laughs> don't know what i'm waiting for but i'm waiting um i'm more inclined to play snow runner really weird yeah yeah right just emptying thank you mark lovely Oh, they got a new as of it was it the atom yeah i think i'll go back to snow runner and tr do it on pc with this steering wheel like this i think it'd be cool would you do that as a multiplayer of course i'll do anything with multiplayer 
Oh, the um, construction sims now cross platform. Yeah, yeah. Um, and it, something else. I think you can use rigs as well. I think you can do voice chat in there now as well. Yeah, cool. uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, he's snow runner. The thing is, with snow runner, you'd have to do it first person, which is fine. Or you'd have to do the the majority of it in third person, first person. Again, I'm third person and controller in that, aren't I? Yeah. One of the um, missions on it, um, you know, it has the three different types of missions you can do. Yeah. One of them is to do the whole of that mission in first person. Oh yeah. Yeah. I can't make, remember which map it's on, but I've done it, and I think I've done it for Chris as well. That's a good. That's a good question, actually, Shane. Who plays on PC in this server, or are you all console? Um, I think we're all console. Yeah. Other than, well, we can tell with the. If you go to the management. Yeah, screen, you can have a look at the icon, can't you? Yeah, like me and Mark are Xbox. Um, What's an Xbox? I'm just joking. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think the other symbol's PS, I think. It doesn't actually say PS, it just looks like a joystick. I think it is, Lawler. I think it is. Yeah, I think they made it cross save, Lawler. So, yeah, I think I'm the only PC guy. Playing farming. The the good the other one question about Snow Runner hmm. is when when we've played it with you. Yeah. Like I've been on my Xbox. Um, I know Jake's been on it with his PS. Yeah. What were you playing it on? I'm always on PlayStation on Snow Runner. Right, because yeah. um, somebody else that streams I'm not gonna name but don't worry. Um he started doing There's other streams <laughs> <laughs> Um he started doing multiplayer with his members but yeah. he he only does it in Discord, he doesn't do it live like you are. Oh yeah. Um and one of his members can always get booted out. Alright. So if if he he's on his PC in the UK playing I think he's on Epic. I don't think he's on Steam. I yeah. think it's Epic. Um, and then his American friend comes in on whatever he's on. PC, I think. But Steam. And it they play fine. But the minute, like, we were testing it, me and Chris were testing it with him and his mate. The minute me or Chris came in, it booted him out. Mm. His friend in yeah. the States. So, <clears throat> he can't his friend can't play with the rest of us yeah. um, for that reason. Now, we don't know whether it's just because he's in the States hmm. and it's a different region. Maybe get I someone else to host it to see whether the same thing happened. It, it did, because I, I think I loaded mine up on the Xbox because we were testing it, obviously, yeah. and it did the same thing. Right. Um, it was when... We was, you remember how I used to get booted off all the time? Yes. They did the update for that, didn't they? Yeah, it was before the update hmm. that it did that, but it still does it now for him. But I've touched wood. I've not been booted off SnowRunner for a long time. So Lee, Lee said, I can't update. believe Kim is talking about other streamers. I can't believe it. <laughs> Lee, I, I'm just letting it go right over me. Yeah? <laughs> really well, what good are you going to do when you're holiday? <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly, yeah. <laughs> something to watch. <laughs> Hello, Beard. How are you? <laughs> yeah, really good, Zevo. It, it's uh, unusual for me to be playing sitting here in third person as well. Normally, I'd be first person. A uh, third person, bloody hell. Yes, cool. It's different. And other discords. I know, Puck. I know. <laughs> Hello, PJ. How are you? PJ's getting married tomorrow. Oh, I know. Okay, None of us have been invited. I can't believe it, really. <laughs> Oh, I think you have, Glenn. This is cool. This is going to take hours, isn't it? Yeah. And so I was saying maybe get two harvesters, but... 
Nah, that's all right. We've done. It's, we've it's nearly a, done it all. It's all Jason's holidays, yeah. It's one of them things, isn't it, when you don't really want to do a small job. Yeah. And you sit back. No, this is cool. Put your foot down. This, this to me is what it's about, you know? Plus, it's yeah. a little bit different than just the usual harvesting I enjoy doing. Yeah, put loads of pictures tomorrow, um, PJ. I've met PJ in real life at EGX. He's a good lad. What have you done to your foot, Beard? Too much stamping on the floor when you're losing Fortnite, isn't it? That's what that is. Look at this. It's cool. I really can't see a difference graphically between the ones that are pruned and the ones that are not. Yeah. And it doesn't show you on the map either. Oh, okay, like it normally does, yeah. Yeah, that's it doesn't show you this. Like at the moment it's saying it we need to plough the field and I'm thinking how do we get a plough down here? Um be a bit different. But I think the the, the thing we've got to cultivate it is actually a subsoil, and that might be the. I'll meet you down the other end, Mark. If that's all right, because I'm going to be full by the time we get down here, Mark. Might even be before then. I'm on 81 percent. Should be all right. But yeah, I'll meet you down here if that's all right. What are you playing at the moment, Beard? Are you pl still playing, um, not Sea of Thieves, the other one? <laughs> sea of Thieves is coming soon, isn't it? 124 over on the right hand side, one of the really long, thin ones. Mark's saying the leaves need to turn brown. I don't know if that's pointed uh -huh. at, at you, Kim. Yeah, it might be. Here's Mark, he's coming down. Ooh. I'm on 94. Probably will fill up by the time I get there. Oh, nice bit. Yeah, the, the help menu just says remember to prune after you harvest it. So. I'll just I'll put this away and just get the mulch out. Right, I'm full up, so I'm coming to you, Mark. Thank you, Giggles. How are you? Oh, that's cool, Sneaky, yeah. Well, before, it's just there, and it? if you don't want to look at it, you don't want to look at it, but for those that enjoy that sort of thing. But last time I had it changing over, and it wasn't working properly, so it's just more subtle this time. I'm still using the controller. The controller's just sitting on my leg there. I'm still using it for bits and bobs. I'm all good, Emma, and I'm very well, thank you, Giggles. There we I did go. see um, on the export dashboard the other day, I did see a, like, a new Star Wars game. Yeah, Star Wars Outlaws, that's coming soon. <coughs> the pictures looked interesting, but the yeah. price was not, because it was over 100 pounds. Over a hundred? Mm -hmm. Oh, bloody hell. That's you know, it gives us the different versions. I know there was three different versions, and only one of them was below a hundred, and oh, it was like God. still 70 odd something. I mean, it like... it's sort of to be expected being Star Wars, but yeah. so every game is going to be that cost, isn't it? Yeah. It will be. It's just... And it just sounds so much money, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah, if you want, if you want an addition with the the expansion, which you're going to want to, otherwise, why yeah. would you, why would you be bothering buying it in the first place? You know, yeah. hundred pounds. It is a lot of money. Oh shit! Haven't turned it on. It's one of the reasons why I've not purchased expedition yet because I want. Yeah. I would want the one that's got everything yeah, in it. Yeah, yeah, of course, yeah. Using pass and all that, just that, like that's Snowball. Our, that's how good bloody Game Pass is, though, isn't it? And Game yeah. Pass, I think, spoils you a little bit as well. 
because you think, well, I get I, I get other AAA games on Game Pass. Why would I pay a hundred quid for this one? <coughs> yeah, but you don't get the DLCs with that. No, unless it's been on for a while. Yeah, which is yeah. Uh, which is all right. Yeah, like you can get on. This is on Game Pass, I think. Yeah, um, so you could play this because we're not using any DLC. You could play yeah. this as part of your. We're only using mods, so yeah, yeah, yeah which is great. But it's not letting me mulch it either at the moment. <laughs> I'm just gonna give up. <laughs> Have you been watching the Fallout series? Yeah, I uh, sat here this morning and watched the first episode, and then uh, when I got Molly home, I watched the second one. Oh yeah, I haven't had a chance um, to do it. It's great. Is it like um, the game? Is it? Is it got vibes of the game, or is it not? Yes, oh. it has. Especially the music. Oh okay. Um, have you ever played Fallout? Not really. No, I played Fallout 4, but I got bored before I got out of the bunker. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I know, it says how much I've changed my attitude towards gaming over the years. I was like, oh god, I ain't got time for this. I'll go, I'll go, <coughs> well, I'll go play Forza or something. It's one of Chris's favourites. Oh, yeah. Um, so, she will tell you, it's incredible. Yeah. Fallout um, 4, are you talking about? Yeah, yeah, I never really played. I think I did play Fallout Three, but didn't go very far in it. What about Seventy Six? Um, what does Chrissy think of that? I, we both got that when it first initially came out. We played it together because it's more of a multiplayer one as well. Yeah, I played it on the channel um, actually. And then we didn't play it for a long time. I was actually asking her today whether she'd played it yeah. at all recently. She hasn't, but I've heard it's better than it was. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but me myself, I've not been on it. Um, but watching the two episodes today, Made you I've, want gone, to try it. I've gone on Fallout 4 and played Fallout 4. Oh, God, today. I bet their numbers have gone right <laughs> up, haven't they? Oh, for fuck's yeah. Sake. Um, That's it. But yeah, it's definitely worth watching. Um, definitely. I think in some way, and this is going to be a big thing for me to say because oh god, oh I god. love god. Halo. Controversial. I, Go on. <laughs> I absolutely love Halo. Yeah. Um, and I've watched, um, <clears throat> I've watched the TV series of Halo. Yeah. That has had a lot of stick. Um. Yeah, but because, if you like it, it's fine, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, I like the series for its graphical wise and. If you ignore the game storyline, then yeah, it works. But yeah. if you are following the game storyline, it doesn't really work. With I think what happens a, in the game. There, there's a mod coming for Fallout, isn't there? Like a UK mod. I'm sure that's Fallout. Yeah, I'm Fallout sure. Fallout London. Is. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So um, is that an addition to Fallout Four? Is that? I will refer to Chris for that because yeah, I can't sure, remember. I'm sure, I'm sure it is. <laughs> Yeah, I know. I know. It's a team working on it. It's like a mod. Yeah. The pictures looked absolutely awesome. Maybe I should just install it and play it. Yeah, do it'll it. Make, it'll make Chrissy happy for a day. Do right? it. <laughs> um, for, the question for, for was that London. Yeah. Yeah. Is it a standalone or is it a mod? Or well, more importantly, it's a mod of, of Fallout Four, isn't it? Y yeah. Because it wasn't seventy six like built from the ground up but it's still got Fallout 4 in it <laughs> um, but yeah the, the Fallout TV series I can tell already it's it's gonna be good and it doesn't matter whether it follows yeah it's got its the own games yeah. because each game has been a different shelter yeah if you get what I mean yes yeah yeah um, Chrissy Sage thinks it's a mod. Yeah, I think it is a mod. It's a team of modders working on it. <coughs> she says, Vault, Kimmy. Vault. Not yes, shelter. Vault, Come on. Chris. I'm not feeling well. Shut up, Chris. Give her a break, alright? <laughs> <laughs> it's normally her getting the word. <laughs> 
Oh, they're doing a next gen version for Fallout 4. Oh, that seems like a perfect. Oh, that would be cool. Yeah. Seems like a perfect use of your your new gen to play old games again. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know whether they're still working on Fallout 76 or they've given up with it. I don't know. Well, they've just I'm sure they've just released another sort of DLC thing yeah. for it. Like I said, that's I, on Game Pass as well. Yeah, I did play it on the channel. I did about three or four streams. It was all right. It was all right. It didn't bite me, I must say. Well, if you didn't get out of the vault, then... <laughs> no, no, that was years ago, Fallout 4. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Yeah, I know there is, Chrissy. Yeah, German Shepherd, isn't there? Yeah. And you can actually get a mod that gives you different dogs, because I was looking for it. Oh, right. Yeah. Is it a game you mod up, Chrissy, or is it you just install it and play it? I'll meet you at the bottom, Mark, again, if that's all right. I reckon we're just over a quarter. Yeah. Through this film. You never modded it. No, that's good. That's good. Yeah, I didn't know if it was one of them games. A bit like Skyrim, where you have to mod that, do you? Um, you don't have to mod Skyrim. No, of course not, but um, to get the best out it, of it. Yeah, yeah. I... I've played Skyrim with mods and without it. Yeah. And it, it mods it does bring a different aspect to the game. Yeah. Um, more, yeah, you can fine tune it, can't you? Yeah. Yeah, you can do different things with it. Um but then as well <clears throat> there's like an unofficial patch in the mods yeah. for Skyrim. Same yeah. with Fallout, I saw that was one in Fallout mod as well. Um which helps fix certain things, obviously. Oh, I got you, yeah. Um, yeah. You know, glitches and that. Yeah, that's what they say about, like, with um, Bethesda, the the mod community fix the game, don't they? Yeah. Have you been playing Starfield at all? Um, I've not been on it for a while. Um, Have you got your full, full achievements yet? I haven't. Chris probably has. She, yeah, she probably has. <laughs> I, wouldn't even, I wouldn't even bother asking her. <laughs> I, I know ask, she got I it. <laughs> I know she got all her fallouts and eh, my fallouts. Listen to me again. She got all her achievements on Skyrim the oh, other yeah. day. So oh, no. big she shout says out. For one her. achievement yeah. left. She's got yeah. one left. But yeah, she's done well getting all the Skyrim because that is not a small game at all. No. Yeah, I'm glad we've got the farm. Like I say, it's been on the back burner for ages, isn't it? But that's yeah, fine. Not everyone yeah. wants to play it all day, every day, do they? No, it still is. I'm though. not on it all the time, like it, you know. No, you were though, and it's probably too much. Right? Yeah, yeah, we we all probably got a bit of burnout, to be honest. Yeah, exactly. Um, yeah. And then it's still meant know. to be a fun video game, isn't it? Yeah. Not a second job. <laughs> Especially a second job you don't get any money from. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Putting more hours into this than your real job. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there probably was at one point. Um, yeah, but look at what you've set up here, that's lovely. Well, it's a team effort. We've yeah. still got less than a million, though. <laughs> We've had several million. Yeah. If you had everything up, you'd be rolling in it. And like, we like have say, got. We, we could sell some equipment if you ever wanted to. Just yeah. To, just to trim it down so it's more manageable. And we have actually got a lot of um, hundreds of silage bales yeah. to sell. Oh, in yeah. January, I think they go, their yeah. best prices. Um, so the money will go up a lot. Yeah. Yeah. Um, uh, yeah, January. Um, it will go up a like low twenty. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah. 
Is Fallout 3 New Vegas a still viable option as a game then, Chrissy? We have girls, yeah. <laughs> okay, I'll sell jo Joseph's tractor now. Yeah, well, he's, <laughs> he's not coming back on, is he? He, he's not he can't PlayStation get back 5. on until he gets his PS5. Yeah. When are you getting your PlayStation 5, Joseph? Is he still here? Oh, Chrissy, okay. Hopefully soon. You was meant to get one for Christmas. What's going on, Joseph? Yeah, Fallout London will be PC, yeah, because of the modding thing. Yeah, he's well, going to get a get mod on Xbox. Oh, right, yeah. So it might, might I should, be I on. should imagine Fallout London would be like an installable mod dome rather than like a mod hub one. Yeah, just have to wait and see. No, I'm calling it now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was fun, Andrew, although I, I did terrible, but yes. It will be, Glenn, yeah. What are you playing at the moment, Glenn? Oh, this is so much better with the steering wheel. It just shows how wrong you can be. I thought, no, definitely not. Control it all the way. But it's actually pretty cool. I might dig mine out. Take a picture of it and put it and show you. Put it in and the vintage then. section. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, a cup of tea for my beautiful wife. Lovely. Thanks, Di. No, <laughs> farm sit. Hello, Eva. Come here, darling. Come here. Well, we've got Eva in. It's because we had new bathroom taps and new central heating. Oh, all right, Joseph. Get yourself down at McDonald's, mate. You'll be able to afford one yourself. Oh, God, let's not start that again. <laughs> <laughs> we know when we're beat. <laughs> no, nah, no cream eggs. God, I'm trying to stop eating. Look at the size of me. Look, I feel like I've ballooned today, specifically. It's really weird. Do you ever get them days where I just feel really big today? Well, it's not something you ask a woman, is it? But <laughs> I'm not going to answer that. <laughs> yeah, I feel proper bloated today. And all DLC. Why, why is that, Chrissy? All DLC. I bet that's them just going, look, don't use our base game to sell your mod. Oh, for goodness sake. That's it. There. Uh, no. Probably uses the assets, yeah, yeah. Has Christopher been back since the incident? I don't think he has, actually. Oh, God. I'd totally forgotten about that, Shane. Oh, Who's God, that was funny. The other what night, incident? The other night when he said, oh, God. What did he say? Oh, well, I'm not even going to say it because we've got a lady on the Were stream. Were you on the stream? Yeah, it was on the stream, in the train city oh. stream, where he said about if he was on the cross... If he was Jesus on the cross. I didn't see that. Was oh, that the God. one that I was watching the football? Yeah. Oh, God. It, it was crazy. It was so funny. Oh, so I might funny. have to rewatch it. <laughs> it, was, it was definitely funny. Okay. I'll tell you what I'm saying. It was like it got funnier. The, Shane started the comedy off because I was shocked by what he said. And I was trying to... <laughs> I was trying to sort of play it down, and then, <laughs> and then Shane uh, started like repeating what he said straight in with it, and it just made me laugh. And then, and then it got funnier and funnier, even though it wasn't really funny. It seemed to the whole situation got really funny, and then we just went off as we normally do. Yeah. <laughs> okay. You can just be like the little innocent little comment. Oh, this wasn't innocent. That's it. No, this is filth. <laughs> 
Oh, three, camp, three and a half hours, yeah. Right. Oh, three <laughs> hours, 21 in. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. Three hours. You might want to put a comment, a, a comma in that one, Andrew. Oh, then you gave him the hammer, so that's not on the replay. Uh, is it not? Oh, yeah, if you've booted someone out, the comments no, are not No, no, I didn't boot him. No, I, I timed him out for a joke afterwards. Yeah, yeah. if you've timed him out, he won't be on there. Oh. oh, that just makes it even weirder, then. Yeah, me and Chris discovered that when you timed us out for helping you. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Shane said it's in the replay for him. Yeah. Well, I'll have a look. Shane's got it bookmarked. <laughs> it's weird because when he actually said it, Shane, I didn't actually laugh that much, did I? It was like, it's come on. You started it off by going, oh, he comes in straight in with it and then you put it inverted commas what he said it just I don't know why it really tickled me and then I knew that everyone found it funny and it just it just got funny right I reckon we're halfway through now is everyone alright in the stream you alright I know it's sort of semi boring but it's not is it it's farming sim it's what we do isn't it <laughs> you were dumbfounded yeah I was like god and then he's tried to blame it oh I saw it in a tiktok video no no Definitely have to go back and watch this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it just it just got funnier. Are you coming down to Brand's Hatch, Kim? Uh, I'm coming with Chris and Neil. Oh yeah, yeah, cool, yeah, nice. Yeah. I better buy me a ticket. I haven't actually bought my ticket yet. <coughs> oh, I think I think it's been booked for us. I think she did. She did tell me how much. <laughs> no, it's not. I'm paying my way. <laughs> um, I can't remember how much it was now, but it's not dear. Sure in, term, in terms of motorsport, it's not a dear day out. Yeah. Compare it to bloody F1. It's peanuts. It's lovely. Yeah, it's Kids go free as that. well. Well, that's that's the thing. It, it's my weekend with the kids, but oh, yeah. it's oh. a bit of a long way to bring them. Yeah, you can um, leave them indoors on their own. Yeah. <laughs> Hope for the best when you get home. <laughs> what, are you going to swap weekends? No, no, um, they'll just spend time with um, my mum and oh, yeah, yeah, cool, yeah. family and stuff, so yeah. good opportunity for them. Um, but, the, you know, they've got school the next day, so... Yeah. Plus, it's a long drive, I know that. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, they're normally all right in the car, but... Yeah. Yeah, I don't want to... You're still going to be that. tired the next day, even if you're just exactly. asleep. Yeah. Yeah, looking forward to seeing you again, Lee. We had a bloody good laugh, didn't we? Oh, for... F My cat's knocking at the window. Just say not today. I know, it just doesn't... It's very persistent. It doesn't give up. Do you want to come forward, Andrew? I don't think I can get it in there, but it'd be quite interesting, actually, to see whether we can. I don't think I can. Of course I can't. I feel like I need to try it, though. He's gone. Coming for the cars, yeah, and me, of course, Chrissy. Come on. <laughs> no, it hasn't. The prompt hasn't come up. No, that's fine. I didn't expect it to anyway. That's all right. Thank you, Andrew. Yeah, I'll be cooking burgers, don't worry about that. I'm going to have to bring a bloody kitchen or something, aren't I? 
<laughs> yep. <laughs> yeah, we can start making raisins now. Oh, for f oh god, I ruined it. I broke it. Yeah, if you move back, Andrew, give me a bit more room. I haven't got plans to, Reuben. No, I haven't. Oh, I haven't got plans to, mate. That's it. Be nice to do some harvesting first person as well. Seeing the full width of the harvester in action. Well, we've got the uh, sugar beet one to do in. Yeah, yeah, we'll do That'll that after this. That'll be interesting, because that's a bit different as well. This is cool. I'm enjoying this. Don't feel you have to stay in chat if you don't want to, Kim, but if you want to, you're more than welcome. Well, I think some of them are on the farm chat. I think. Whatever you want to do. Paris says 120 is done. Oh, sorry to hear that, Gary. My condolences, mate. Uh, what would that be on the, that weekend at Bright? Yeah, uh, on the Sunday the 30th, Shane. Sunday the 30th of June. Is anyone coming to meet me at the bottom of the field to unload? Is that you, Mark, who's still doing that? Uh, he's on his way back. Okay. He's, um just unloaded at the grape factory so the raisins are being made now so that's cool are they being put in them little boxes that you buy raisins in that's <laughs> that's a waste of a box isn't it yeah <laughs> it really is good day people it's friday saturday tomorrow yeah dean that's it he's got the hang of it now well done dean <laughs> <laughs> is actual car show or actual racing yes yeah, the 90s touring car stuff so you're going to see all the old classic um, 90s touring cars. It's a brilliant day out, Shane. We did it last year. That was their first um, their first event, and uh, they put a lot into it as well. There's just cars constantly all day. Yeah, well done, Dean. Well done, mate. That's it. And then what comes after that, Dean? <laughs> <laughs> oh God, I'm such a piss taker. I don't know why they put up with me, you know. What do you um, think? What do you think of this in first person uh, chat? Because normally I've got you in third person, seeing all the machinery. What do you think of it in comparison to to being in the cab rather than just looking at the machinery? I think it's more immersive for me. That's for sure. That's it. Let me straighten up a bit, Mark, and then uh, I'll reverse up. You're really not sure, are you, Dean? <laughs> perfect, Mark. Absolutely perfect. I'm too focused on the hand cam to notice. I know either. You are, right, darling. Um, can we just grab Mort? Mort? Um, can we stop bailing? Mort, you're being, to... you're being told off, Mort. <laughs> I'm not telling him off. Yeah, yeah, tell him off. Tell him <laughs> off. He needs it. Look at him. He's all over the place. We we just don't need any more bales. We've got enough. Just stop um, it, Mort, will you? For goodness sake. So if we could use the foragers and put these in the bunkers next to them. He thinks that's how the little baby Weetabixes are made, doesn't it? <laughs> Yeah, yeah, you use first third person as well, Shane, yeah. Always have done. Now I'm thinking Snow Rider <coughs> might be good on first person. Oh, I can't still hit the window. Let him in. He'll come in and then they'll freak out because Molly's here. Oh, oh, right, yeah. Do they get, they get on? on? They yeah. get on fine, but... Yeah, just give me a minute. Who, who's... Oh, she's gone. 
Oh god, Mortz has left the server. I was only joking, Mortz. Oh, your game just crashed. Got worried then. Mr. Tippy from a new perspective. Do you want to come out, baby bird? There you go. I've opened his cage. He might come out. He's been out of me all afternoon. He's such a good boy, my bird. He'll be over in a minute. Hello. Hello. He's a good boy. Oh. Did March just leave? No, he crashed. Yeah. Okay. He said something cool. about he can't he can't put up with you anymore. Oh. And your bossy attitude. <laughs> 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 no, he crashed. He'll be back in a minute. Oh. Hello, birdie boy. Yeah, I had a little half hour on the uh, sofa in the conservatory earlier, and the old bird was sitting there. Oh, he's he's so lovely. Oh, nice. He's letting me actually like pick him up now by his body, and he, he's just not disturbed by it. Just pick him up, move him over, just get him used to my hand even more, you know? Yeah, that's really good. He gets a bit touchy of a night. Like if I if he's all tucked up and I go up to the cage, he will spit at me. <laughs> just to he say no. To sleep. Yeah, no, not even if he's asleep. After a certain time, usually about now, actually. Like he's had enough. He doesn't want any interaction at all, and he's happy to tell you no. But is that he, why he's come out to say goodnight to you? <laughs> mate, well, he was up at. He's got a certain perch, and it's attached to the door. If he's on there, he's basically saying to me, "I want to come out." So that's how we communicate. If he's up on his swing or anything like that, I leave him. If he wants to come out, he knows to get on that one. Yeah. And he's just been on that one, so I was like, "Well, do you want to come out?" And he did. He flew straight out. Um, I'm just going to grab a trailer to help out with this stuff. I'm not going to use the big one because it's a bit awkward. Where we need to put it. It's turning into bird cam now rather than hand cam, isn't it? Hello, baby boy. He just jumps from my shoulder to the edge of the chair back to my shoulder and just keeps on doing that he loves it <laughs> come on in and Eva's just laying down just looking at him <laughs> are they bothered by each other now Cause... well Eva's a little bit scared of the bird now I think funnily yeah. enough yeah but That's they cute. tolerate each other yeah but yeah they don't really interact Colonel thank you very much and Sophie got that Thank you. Welcome back, Sophie, and thank you, Colonel. Oh, nice one. He's a good guy. Yeah. Well, you're all lovely. All of you. Even Chrissy. <laughs> what you um, doing, Birdie? I don't want to sound bossy again, but I've got the machine that we need more. You're not bossy. They want your direction. <laughs> That's fine. Come on, Come on. Come Pet on. Pets are great, though, aren't they? Yeah. It's that it. from when they just stand there staring at you. Like, mm -hmm. You're supposed to know what they're thinking. I know what she's thinking. And I'm telling her she can do it. But she's still staring at me like, what? I might start calling you go long, Colonel. I can't imagine a house of no pets. Just can't imagine it. Oh no. She's just brought me a toy to play with. It's not a mouse, is it? Uh, no, it's a blue duck that oh. she actually flicked around the room before and smacked into my foot. The one that I actually put a picture on this card oh, yeah. on. Yeah, and it's got yeah. one of them rag things as a tail. You know, where they have the knots and it's like really hard. And it's smacked into my toes and it really I, hurt. I buy Eva toys, but within an hour, all the white stuffing's all over the house. 
She just, whatever <laughs> one it is, she'd rip it apart. Yeah. Um, we've got, I went to Pets and Own, we've got one of the real tough ones. Yeah, even the Kong one, she um, has them. Yeah, she just dips yeah. her teeth in there. Um, Mark, well, come come back to the field, mate. He uh, said, he said shall I wrap the bales or just collect them? Leave them for now. We'll just pick the rest of the grass up and put it in the bunker. It won't take five minutes to pick all those bales up later on. Don't you pull on my shoulder. Come here. Come here, baby boy. <laughs> oh, yeah, you're a good bird. That's all right, Sophie. Definitely can, man. Yeah, well, they, I mean, they're easy to destroy, even the tough ones. They've only got to get their, their teeth in there and they can start ripping it. Can't yeah. They? I mean, Molly's destroyed one of their cons. Yeah. And only because a certain person didn't put it back together again and left it out, mm -hmm. separated. So she uh, she got managed to get a teeth flight all the way around it just demolished it. So. so you're sort of sh not being personal, but you're sort of sharing custody of your dog as well? Um if it was supposed to be one weekend a month I would have her while he had the kids. Yeah, yeah. Um make it easier a bit easier on him as well. Yeah. Um but then in the summer he decided to change that. Um because it was only really a verbal agreement. Yeah. Um and then this is now the first time I've seen her since August. Oh, all right. Um, oh, so. I'm, I'm full up, Mark. Is it easier to go at the back? Um, Mark's just asked me to tell Andrew that the red trailer won't work. So whichever trailer he's got, it's not going to work. So have the kids been sort of seeing the, um, the dog? Yeah, they they yeah, see they've good, been yeah. seeing her because obviously he's got yeah probably seen Molly. Him, you? Yeah, they've been seeing her every other weekend. So, yeah. you know, I'd sort of come to the conclusion that I wouldn't have her again. Yeah, and would only probably see her if I picked the kids up from his, which I don't. He drops them off and collects them and all that. So, um, I had already sort of accepted that I wouldn't have her again, but. Um, he's since what we went through a financial court thing, you know, yeah. we've got the hats and stuff, <coughs> and he had it put in the agreement that he owns the dog, but right. I can I can have her for visits <laughs> when, um, it, when it's convenient for him. You mean? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. When he wants to go on holiday. Yeah, because he kept saying, oh, you might take her and never give me a back. And I'm like, oh, when have I ever said that? Yeah. There's been no occasion where that's even been a thought in my mind. You know, I'm full time, two young kids. Yeah. I Unfortunately, I can't give her the time she needs. Yeah, of course, yeah. Every single day. So, yeah. you know, having her from a Thursday night to the Sunday which is when he drops the kids back off yeah you can handle it's that it's perfect and yeah give it, give it loads of attention yeah because I work from home on a Friday as well so I can take her for the walks in the morning yeah um so yeah <laughs> but you it, you it will change again I know it will change again and Chris will agree with me because mm -hmm. at the moment it's in he's like it, it's a bit like he's in this la la land so yeah. happy so something will tick him off and then I won't see Molly again for months <laughs> so yeah my bird's disappearing is. down the back of my t-shirt I think Yeah, like Lee says, it's never easy when you separate them. Bloody hell, we should know. And <laughs> yeah. Lee, he, he does it on a weekly basis. Oh, Tommy, Tommy, two two wives. <laughs> I'm only joking, Lee. 
I've got to go all the way down here. Well, we got our, like, the kid's side of things sorted out, but it's just the way he is with me. Yeah. Um, and he thinks I don't know things like that. I don't well, know if I should say this because Well, it's... remember when you're you're on live stream. Yeah, yeah. No, he, I'll he say He might that even be listening now. I doubt it. <laughs> Sneaky, thank you very much. Gary, oh, I'm, Gary got I'm it. full marts, I need to go and empty. Be right back. Don't move. Thank you, Sneaky, I appreciate that. And welcome back, Gary, uh, to being a member. What but, are you um, doing, Birdie? Put it this way, you think, you know, I'm quite technical. Yeah. You know, I you're know re you're reading his emails basically. <laughs> Come on, I'm not yeah. silly. Oh <laughs> no, I don't want to read his emails. <laughs> um, but I know that a 24 inch Dell is not worth an ultra wide. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and I'll I'll let, tell you about that later. <laughs> No, I know, Lee. I was only making light of it. I know, Dean. I'd already done that that part. There was no grapes there. So I had to go all the way to the end. But now we're going to start picking up again. <coughs> oh. Why is it birdie? sometimes you just can't realize? Yeah, I was already halfway through that thing. That's why I had to wait my way to the end. <laughs> can you can you see my bird jumping around on the stream? I can't see him. He's on my right shoulder. Oh, bloody hell. It's a little bit delayed as well. So. <laughs> Not stuck. Oh, God. Lee's going in for wife number three now. Just joking. <laughs> <laughs> what you doing, Birdie? <laughs> Even looks up when I say that. What's he doing? <laughs> Do you want me to sort him out? <laughs> A marriage disaster. He's always on the lookout for the next Mrs. Uh, T. Dot com Lee. <laughs> um, Lee's making a move. <laughs> Only jokingly, just messing with you, you know that. Oh, funny, yeah. You need to go in the good book again. What do you mean, Dean? What do you mean? What are you doing, Birdie? What are you doing? <laughs> Come on. I've done so many of these now, I've still got not, not got the complete hang of the, the best position to have it in. Well, it's certainly more interesting than the normal uh, harvesting. You've got to pay more attention to it, haven't you? Because if you yeah, it's a little bit left yeah. or a little bit right, and yes. then you'll just get stuck. You're right. What you haven't written your speech yet already, Lee? Um, uh, sorry, PJ. Mm, really yeah, I think it is, Park. Yeah, it's not moving, is it? I hope you're going to mention me, PJ. <laughs> <laughs> I owe this all to Jason at Game Tech UK. All of it. Isn't PJ a fellow North or Northwesterner? Well, do you want to put it into chat, PJ? I don't mean put your speech in there. Put some help in chat. 
there's a lot of weddings between us, I'm sure. <laughs> Oh, oh. What, and that's it? Just drop the mic, Chrissy. That's it, is it? <laughs> mic dropped. <laughs> Honestly, he's probably got some spares. <laughs> oh, God. Now, let's lock up and get drunk and then drop the mic. What are you doing, little baby? Has anyone got a Skoda Satigo? Never heard of it. Chat GPT, yeah, yeah. It's your second marriage too. Well, remember not to mention your first wife. Just don't, just do that. And don't call her by your first wife's name. Oh God. <laughs> don't do a Ross. Yeah. With friends, right? I'm full Mart. Back in a minute. I'll need emptying down here, Mark. If you want to meet me down the bottom. I have some experience. I have some thoughts on this. Mm. What's that clunking noise? That's Molly. Oh, yeah. right, yeah. Collar. Yeah, oh, yeah. Sorry. She's just having a good old scratch. And she's already nearly got the bottom end of the duck off so yeah didn't last long is she comfortable at your gaff considering she doesn't normally go there she, is she oh yeah there? she was as yeah. soon as i turned the engine off before and she popped her head up oh, on the good. back she was like she was almost over the back seat yeah trying to get out to like have a run around she's yeah no problems whatsoever um thanks mark she doesn't have a den under the stairs anymore because we're trying to sell the house, so I've had to put the cupboard back on. Yeah, yeah. The cupboard door on the stairs, under the stairs. Um, so, yeah, she was a bit like Harry Potter with the bed under the stairs. No, don't start great. nibbling my Porsche rim, thank you very much. Thanks, Mark. So I've only got a few more runs to do. You're always welcome, PJ. You know that. And it's always nice when you meet people in real life as well, isn't it? We've met. Yeah, I'm really we've looking had a forward to it. Oh, gotcha. She's run off to her bed now. <laughs> Does she go upstairs or? Um, initially she didn't. Yeah. Um, in our old house, she wasn't allowed upstairs. Yeah, Eva's not allowed upstairs. Um, yeah, but we had like um, a, ho a doored hallway. Yeah. Um, yeah. But this house, there's no door separating the hallway and the stairs. Um, so she she can get upstairs. Um, and I don't, you know, initially she wasn't allowed on the bed and all that, but. Mm -hmm. I don't have it. I don't have it that often, so yeah. I'm having all the snuggles tonight. Oh, I, I mean, oh, don't get me wrong. <laughs> I would love to have Eva on the bed, but yeah. she's hairy enough as it is, and we've got all like hard floors downstairs, so it's so easy yeah. to hoover and mop. And she's so hairy. Oh my god! At certain yeah. times of the year, when she right. drops, oh my god! I'm just gonna take this toy off her. Yeah, we've had some good laughs, haven't we, Glenn, in real life at EGX? She's really just ripped the whole bottom bit off it. Don't oh, could be what like that. <laughs> she looks like she's got a, a like legs crossed, and she's like giving me the look. <laughs> like you shouldn't chew it as much if you have. Oh God, he's disappeared onto my Porsche rim now. I don't think that's really a good idea. <laughs> Where are you going? Hey, 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 back here, back here, back here. No, Eva, no. Back here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. That's it. What's wrong? Why did you fly off? Hey? Do you want to go back to bed now? 
think I'll put him in bed. He, go, he goes off on one, starts flying around the house. But <laughs> see, there's Eva right in front. Eva just doesn't make eye contact with him now. She knows. Is he the boss? I think so, yeah. 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 Right, I'm gonna put my head put him back into bed. Two seconds. I'm back. Hello. Right. We're nearly done here. Oh, I say nearly. Bloody hell, we've still got quite a few. But that's fine. <laughs> You've had some tough times when watching this channel, Colonel. I don't think... I think you're misunderstanding. Let's turn it off. It's bloody cold in here. <coughs> I'm going to go out to this box. Yeah, I've enjoyed this tonight. The first person has absolutely elevated it for me. So that's cool. What's late, Joseph? Yeah, see you later, Sneaky. Thanks, mate. And um, thank you. How are you, Jam? Hello, Mustang. How's that Jake doing the chat? Yeah, he's at work. Hey, Jake. Hey, Peter Welsh, you won the giveaway. Uh, yeah, you won the giveaway. I did put a message. Are you in Discord, Peter? Yeah, you won the giveaway, so I've got to give you a £10 voucher. Um, email me, Peter, by the way. That might be easiest if you're not in Discord. But yeah, I've been away obviously last week, but before then I was trying to chase you. And Crafty Martin as well, but I haven't seen him around for a while. But yeah, Peter, just email me and then let me know what voucher you want. Or if you've got PayPal, I can PayPal you it straight away. It's nice and easy. <laughs> Is it too late to open a bag of Maltese? No. It's never too late to open a bag of Maltese. No, definitely not. I had a caramel um, um, Easter egg. Do you know caramel? It's Isn't like, that the Cadbury's one? Yeah, it's like caramel. Yeah. But oh, it made me feel I sick. Love. But it was very addictive. I love caramel. Yeah. They don't seem to do Caramax anymore. You, you go into no, the just shops, they just don't do them. They've stopped making them. Yeah, so obviously Caram Milk has come in, swooped yeah. in, taken over, seen a weakness and struck. 
Yep. But it tastes really nice. Well, do they literally don't make Caramac anymore? Is it gone? I'm sure I saw something that the, said... The trouble is, it was anything. very thin. There was nothing there, was there, really? You could eat yeah. it in two seconds. If you got I'm it and crunched not. it up in your hand and just shoved it in your mouth, it would be gone in ten <laughs> seconds, wouldn't it? <laughs> they did a survey. Is it by the same people? Different people, wasn't it? But okay. caramel milk was uh, that was a that was like eating a blast from the past because it just tasted like caram caramac. Oh god, different. Yeah, different. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, Peter. I don't know if you heard that, mate, but let me know that you did hear that because I always make sure I trace all the winners up. You can get caramac munchies. Oh bloody hell! What like the mint munchies, but caramac ones? Disgusting. I love <laughs> mint munchies. Oh god, yeah. Again, though, they're, they're just you can just keep popping them, can't you? Yeah, it's like after eights. I think I'll empty out on you, Mark, as well. Just here, might as well. Please say again, thank you. Yeah, you won the giveaway on the last member stream, so I owe you a £10 voucher, uh, Peter. You can have Xbox, PlayStation, Steam, or um, uh, it's just easier if I PayPal you. But if you email me, I'll put my email address in there. I'll go through some security checks with you, because otherwise, otherwise someone else might go, oh, I'll email him and I'll get a £10 voucher. <laughs> <laughs> I'll bloody email him. Uh, yeah, email me there. If you're not in Discord, Peter, I couldn't find you in Discord actually. Uh, right, what am I doing? Let's go there. That's fine. Thanks, Mark. What's it like, Chrissy? Or was it just a uh, an achievement game you played? Yeah, if you go into, um, I mean, I don't shop there much, but if you go into Lidl, they do a lot of the copy chocolate, and they probably still got a lot of this stuff going anyway. Yeah, they will. Like they do, like marathons and Snickers, oh, sn Snickers and all that, don't they? Yeah. But their own version, they're normally pretty nice. Sometimes better than the uh, the proper version, as it were. No, we're going to sell um, Joseph Tractor Jab. Yeah, we need to. We need a staff party, so we're just going to sell it. <laughs> I'm actually using Joe's tractor. Yeah, we're just going to sell it and just frivol it away on anything. Get like I don't know, staples, paper, you know, just stuff we don't need. <laughs> <laughs> a gas barbecue, you know. Yeah, they were too small, Mustang, which is probably why people didn't choose them, did they? Especially these days of like the tradition of the bag, well, the, the grab bag, and the sharing bag, which no one shares. And then suddenly you choose a Caramac, which is tinsy. No, no. Oh no, we are Joseph. Yeah, we're going to get um, toilet air freshener. We're going to get everything with it. Yeah, we're going to get cream eggs. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh for. Come on, what's going on? Why all of a sudden is it hard to do? Is it there? Come on. Right, let me have a look. What's going on? Come on. What's nothing wrong with that? No, we're doing it, Joseph. Yeah, we're going to get... Um, I'm going to sell it and have a paintballing weekend. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm going to buy extra pellets, even if I don't need them. It's been Snickers for over 30 years. I know, I like to call them marathons. My uh, dad was always like that. He always called it a marathon, yeah. even uh, though uh, it was uh, a Snickers. And Starburst as well. Yep. No, yeah. Opal Fruit, sorry, rather than Opal Starburst. Opal Fruit, yeah. What was, why change that? I don't, I don't get it. Uh, Obviously for a more European market, I'm sure. 
Like they word. changed um, GIF to SIF, didn't they? Because yeah. <laughs> people weren't pronouncing the, the, the... Yeah, they just couldn't pronounce it. Yeah, Dad had funny names for a lot of different things. You used to call... You know that close shot monsoon? Uh, yeah, yeah. You used to call it mongoose. <laughs> it used to make me laugh every time. We took a vote, yeah, it's gone, isn't it, Mark? It's gone. Hopefully, stream, you're not um, you're not bored with this, because I know I've been doing the same thing for the last two hours, but it's all good, isn't it? Yeah. <coughs> well, probably hour and a half. Made to make your mouth water. All about Milky Way. I know we spoke about this before. The meal you can eat between meals without ruining your appetite. What? What? What a thing to mark it on. Go on, kids, eat this. Eat this all day. Your mum won't mind. What they're basically saying is it's not very filling. Crazy. Texan oh. bars. I don't. I don't remember them. I'm sure of it. Yeah, pretty much the whole stream in first person, eh? I love peanut butter. Oh, God. Oh, no thanks. I mean, the peanut butter stuff, like, you know, peanut butter bar or, like, peanut butter kidney. Uh, ki kidney? Ki uh, Kit Kat. It doesn't actually taste like peanut butter itself. I suppose, like, tomato sauce doesn't actually taste like tomato. It doesn't, does it? No. No, definitely not. Yeah, Toffos are good, yeah. 92% <laughs> fresh air, yeah. A boost peanut butter, okay. Someone's I up remember that. <laughs> we'll send you a pot. We haven't sold it, Joseph. We haven't sold it. I'm using it at the moment. Yeah, don't worry. Don't you worry. When you get a PlayStation 5, you can have it back, because we'd have moved on by then anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, spaghetti. Eva? Can you hear her barking? Yeah. Only a little bit though, not not that loud. <laughs> yeah, calm down, Jake. Hello, Hugger Wookie, how are you? Yeah, we'd have moved on by then. We'd have all got bored and been playing Fallout 3 by then. Fallout 4. <laughs> Maybe we should have some horse racing on here. <laughs> I'm just going to find out why she's barking so much. Two seconds. Marks, follow me, Marks. Come this way. Right, that's that sorted. 
How's the weather down there now, uh, Wookie? I bet it's nice now. I'm not. Me and Colonel aren't down there. Right. Here we go. No, it's very rare you'll hear Eva barking like that. There was a reason my wife had locked herself out. Oh, dear. Yeah. <laughs> she's just gone to pick Max up and forgot the car keys, but she had locked herself out, so she went around the back. She was actually knocking on the back door. That's why she was barking. Yeah. And I thought, why is she barking that much? Right, there we go. Right, we're nearly done. Look, you can actually see an end in sight. We've got one, two, three, four more rows to do. Then we'll do some other harvesting in first person. How about that, eh? What sort of time is it, anyway? Oh, it's 10.04. I can see that. Plenty of time. Like I say, Kim, don't feel like you have to stay in chat. It's all good. You're more than welcome if you want to. Yeah, I was thinking I might head off because no, you, you... I need to sort my throat out. Yeah, exactly. Really you're <laughs> If you're in chat, then you're sort of tired to here, aren't you? You do whatever you want to yeah. do. But I think some of them have got, you know, in chat in the game, but... Whatever you sure want to if... do, you're more than welcome to stay. Uh, yeah, I've got no... <clears throat> I'm gonna head off. Yeah, don't worry. Still, still be in the game, but yeah, of course, yeah. No, if you want to come back in chat, just let me know. Yeah. Well, thank you for all that you do in the uh, in the farm, Kim. No problem. It's team effort. And I'll ask you what yeah. to do once I've done these other four rows. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's plenty of contracts. Yeah, all definitely. these are sugar beet. I yeah. might actually start the sugar beet, um, and then you can take that over if you yeah. want. Yeah. Okay. Um, or, or leave it for me. Whatever. Yeah, I'll, I'll get it set up and I'll just start it. Because right. it takes a long time anyway. Yeah. I think that's why nobody ever wants to do it. <laughs> I reckon about another 20 minutes I'll be done here. Yeah. All right, cool. Thank you, Kim. All right, thank you. See you later. Bye. Is that, that's a telephone voice, isn't it? Bye. <laughs> <laughs> just do a normal goodbye. See you later. <laughs> See you later. All right, bye. Bye, bye. No, she's gone. Yeah, I didn't want to feel like she had to stay. That's why I said that, but it's all good. Right, you got me back now. Rambling and talking for no reason. Have you got me on CV yet? Yeah. How's your job hunting going, uh, um, Joseph? There we go. Oh, I love this with the steering wheel. It's so cool. There's Andrew just standing in the naughty corner. Look at him. What's he up to? Look. Trousers down his ankles. Look. He says, oh, I love farming. Right, we've got, yeah, four more to do. Lovely. I'll meet you down the other end, Mark, again, because I'll need, I'll need emptying. I'm not sure what he's doing, Punk. I'm not sure. Oh, it's very relaxing, though, with this game, isn't it? And I like these streams as well. It's just about chatting and talking absolute shite, really, isn't it? Love it. <laughs> He's topping up the manure heap. Oh, that's lovely. That's lovely, Shane. <laughs> How's your head, Para? You all right now? This is definitely quite a time-consuming job. I bet it's not one of the most uh, uh, financially rewarding harvests either, but it doesn't matter, does it? You can't al When you're gaming, you can't always do the stuff that reaps the biggest re financial reward, can you? It was a bit like that in Elite Dangerous. You know, it was like, oh, I've just got to do the most, the most um, sort of activity. I've got to do the activity that's going to get me the most return for my time. Nah. You just do uh, you just do what you enjoy, don't you? 
don't think a lot of people use the ghost. Yeah, I think that's that was Kim's point really that you might not see it being harvested very often on stream. So it's nice to show off another part. Plus, that machinery is pretty cool, isn't it? I mean, some of this machinery is just insane, isn't it? Yeah, I, I honestly think most of the time I'll be playing this here now, and I'll, I do want to give SnowRunner a run first person using the steering wheel as well. Oh, I jab. Let me finish this one first, mate. God dear. <laughs> crazy that this is actually based on real life as well and it's not just some video game sort of creation this is as clo oh oh bloody hell hello what was that has kim come back in that's weird Let's have a look. Uh, oh yeah 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 that's all good that's all good that was discord chucking me out because i was still in the chat essentially <laughs> he passed every tractor, yeah. I was like the tractor last week in the old camper van. Everyone was waiting for me. Definitely feels like you're more in control of this uh, machinery, that's for sure. You think that would squash the grapes, really, wouldn't you? Or burst them? It must be quite strong. So it's quite the quite the drop, isn't it? I mean, it's just crazy the the level of detail. You've even got to use the correct uh, trailer. It's, this is not, in a way, very um, beginner friendly, is it? I should imagine a lot of people get put off by it. Oh God! I I mean, there, there's a lot for me to remember, and I only have to come on and ask questions. It's quite, it's quite an intricate game, isn't it? Not difficult, but just knowing what to use and when, I suppose. Oh, and past every sheep. I bloody love sheep, though, don't you? They're so cute. There was loads in um, in Cornwall with their little babies. That was nice. Right, can we make it properly? It's fine once it starts, like, come on, there, that's it, no, no, oh god, I'm riding up on it now, <coughs> yes, yes, that's it, that's it, right, we've got, um, this is one of three now, and then we'll be able to move on to something else. Yeah, very cool. So I'll be back to normal on the channel next week, but uh, I don't know. Oh, well, I'm not streaming tomorrow night because obviously Friday night's moved to Thursday night. That's all good. I don't know if I'm streaming during the day tomorrow, but if not, I'll be around. I've got one more Moser video to make. I'm replacing the handbrake, the Sparco handbrake that I've got with Moser. Then I've got the full Moser kit, then. Lovely. Then I want to do, um, so I'll do an unboxing and a setup on that. And then um, I need a circular wheel, because I haven't got a circular wheel outside of this one. This one's too big to go rallying on. I'm going to sneeze again. <laughs> oh, God, you got your iron a Yamaha 350LC. Send me pictures, Lee, and then I can, I can draw all over it as well. Send me pictures and I'll buy it. <laughs> <laughs> that would be a very nice bike and I tell you what that would be as long as you're playing a, paying a realistic price that's an investment because it will go up what was I saying I got distracted by the 350 LC <laughs> yep can't remember what I was saying it's fine Hello, George, how are you? What was you doing wrong in the server? I saw your little tweet you sent me. You didn't tell me what you were doing wrong. What were you doing wrong that you couldn't see the ACC server? 
That's right, another wheel. Yeah, that's it, yeah. So really I need a, um, a circular sim racing wheel because at the end of the month they got the VR update on WRC. Um, so I definitely want to be touching on that. But I'm really enjoying doing hardware videos, actually. They're, they're good. I like it. It's going to be quite tricky to turn around here, isn't it? I'll meet you down the other end again, Mark. Then I'll meet you up the top, and that will be um, fully done then. Yeah, me too, Beard, yeah. That will get me back into at least updating the headset and seeing where I'm at with that. They've got the new Pimax coming out as well, which uh, is going to be a big boy, but... It's unforgivable how stupid I was being. Well, tell me, because I did tell you in the stream that you had to click GT3, otherwise it would show up with no servers. So I don't know whether you heard that. Right, we're almost done. This is a really good harvest. I've only got a, um, a Rift um, Rift S, an old now, but that's fine. The new Pimax is the, um, you know, the wide one. I think it's got a fucking stupid high um, resolution. That would be nice to get me hands on that. But I'll definitely get me headset um, all set up. You never know, it might kickstart some interest in VR again for me. We'll have to see, won't we? No, he didn't mean that melody, he meant um, VR headset PC. <laughs> More unboxing and corners. The last couple of bits didn't have corners. Uh, it didn't have corners, Colonel. Yeah, for some stupid reason, I was, I was tempted the other day to get the Quest. Or is it that is standalone? Um. Just for some fitness stuff, really. I thought, no, don't buy an, another bloody gadget. What are you thinking of? <laughs> I was gutted. You were crushed. You needed corners, didn't you? Yeah, I'll empty with you here, Mark, and then I'll meet you at the top. Is your job better than the other one, Melody? Or are you still sort of gauging that bit out? Ah, oh, you got the DLC and somehow didn't manage it. Yeah, because the, the server won't show up if you haven't got the DLC. But we'll be doing that again anyway, Norchlifer. We won't be doing it in the dark, probably. And we won't be doing it in the rain. Just proper... Yeah, that was good. I enjoyed that. Well, you know in your heart of hearts, though, don't you, Melody, already? You know in your heart of hearts. What's your initial feeling? Pretty much too uncomfortable to use out the box, yeah. You've got to take the box off, Beard. You can't just, you can't just put them on out the box. <laughs> Childish, isn't it? do have to take them out of the box. Otherwise those corners they do um, they do hurt. Yeah I'll empty with you up here Mark up the top and then that's me done then. Oh that's good Melody that's good. My current employer is terrible. Oh, it's me. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's, it's me. He always it says yes though when I ask him for a pay rise. <laughs> it 
And what brand is it, Kim? She's like, I don't know, it's circular. And learning new stuff is like a new, it's a new challenge, like a new video game, isn't it? It doesn't say. Plug it in, and your PC will tell you what it is. Yeah, more to give himself a pay rise. Yeah, it's just like starting a new video game, isn't it? Right, we can move on to something else. 40 quid for an hour's driving lesson. Yeah, 40 quid. 40 quid's cheap, isn't it? They've been 40 pound for ages, haven't they? But I suppose, the, you know, you, you can't start pricing yourself out of the market. You, you're sort of bound by what the others do, aren't you? It's almost like you've got to do it in unison. You've got to speak to each other and go right. Within three months, we're all blood, we're all going to be say fifty-five to sixty quid. Then then people have got no choice. If you start doing it, then they'll just your competitors will just clean up, won't they? Well, that's why I'm doing this really, uh, Wookie. I was. Uh, seven, oh, it was 15 years into my business 16 years I think it was oh god I was bored I was really bored now when like Melody's just done you know if you're bored you can just go and get another job can't you but unfortunately when you when you work for yourself and you're so entrenched in your own business it's part of your fucking DNA you, you, just everything your whole life is built around it you can't just get another job and you do, to a certain extent, become trapped. It's a lovely place to be trapped, don't get me wrong. Um, but, oh my god, I've been through two recessions, which nearly bloody killed me. And I just had enough. Oh my god, and I had enough. I had no soul or passion into it. And if you know what I'm like, I'm quite sort of passionate about things. And I was always passionate about my business. I'd, I'd work any hour that God sent on my business any hour I wouldn't care if it's two in the morning it, it, it meant nothing to me I would do it because I absolutely loved it and then the passion just went um, oh god did it go luckily m the stars aligned and my eldest son was available to sort of take over and he's been doing that for the last uh, well the last six years seven years so I've still got that business I don't do very much in it because they're running it I pay them to run it and I do this, this is where my passion is it's lovely and maybe the passion will go for this, I don't think so I don't think so, but yeah, so it is hard when you're not stuck in a job but you're stuck in a job especially when that job is your own job <laughs> where shall I put this? it's a numbskull oh yeah, I know numbskull yeah, they're pretty good recently actually they're all like the controller tops, don't they? oh, you'll probably get a driver for that I'm going to stick it in here and then go and see what Chrissy's doing. No, I'm going to put it around the corner here. Actually, let's uh, put it over in the corner at least. I mean, you don't want to just give up your business, absolutely not. I employ people, but... I was just, I was just done with it. Oh my god, waking up every day, it's like, uh And now I wake up and go right, bound out of bed because we got stuff to do. Love it. Oh, we got a jet wash there. Oh, all right, I'll clean it. I'll clean it. And if you watch the channel, you know I love doing this. Oh my god. I mean, I don't even class it as a job, really. Well, I do and I don't. I do and I don't. I, it's always awkward when you... Um, no, don't do that. It's always awkward when you make a business out of your... Um, is this working? 
What's the, where's the prompt? Oh, here we go. Uh, yeah, that's it. Yeah, when you make a business out... Why is it not working? Why? <laughs> For fuck's sake. Hang on a minute, right? Just bloody hang on. Right, turn that. Where's the water? Where's the bloody... There it is. It's not trigger, is it? It's not the right trigger. Yeah, it's always awkward when you make a business out of your passion. They say, they do say if you if you you know make your job your passion, you'll never work a day, which is true, absolutely. But at the same time, you almost deprive yourself in a funny kind of way of a hobby, because now your hobby is um, is your job. But it, it's still fine. It's not a problem. Yeah. Good night, Melody. But if anything happened and I had to go back to work tomorrow, I'll just, you know, I'll have to go back. It's not a problem. It's all there for me if I want to go back. But do I want to go back or do I want to sit here playing farming sim? <laughs> That's an easy one, isn't it? <laughs> it was always a passion, yeah, yeah. Right, that's it. That's that one done. Well, I'm just going to park that there. And if you step out, maybe, um, Kim, and then I can... Is it this one? Yeah, it must be this one. Yeah. Are you all right if I take over, Kim? So, you, oh, it won't even take long, will it? Okay. So, if we'll... Um, so, we need to unfold it. customers yeah 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 I must admit I don't like serving people <laughs> I used to love it love it right back to first person because that's what we're all about these days oh look at this make sure that is actually doing it no that doesn't seem to be doing anything unless I've got have I got the wrong field or is it just taking the top off of them or something I mean it is um, well next field okay <laughs> What the field behind? Is it the field behind? I just saw it saw it there and I thought, oh lovely, here we go. <laughs> Next field. <laughs> yeah, she's testing it and I failed. Right, this one. Right, is it this one? Let's have a look at the map. You're saying, um, oh God, where am I? 49, where is 49? Oh, don't do that. Don't, just, just stop it. Let's see. Right, where am I? You had one job. Yeah. Field 49. Where am I then? Where, where am I? Where is even 49? I don't know where this is. Hello, Lewis. How are you? Uh, oh, I don't know. I'll just guess. I'll just guess that it's this one. Is it this one? Next to 41. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. Where's 41 then? You're in 53. I'm really having trouble seeing myself. Where's my... Where, where am I? Is this me here? Yeah, that's me there, yeah. And it's um, 49. Okay. Oh, I got you. Why was you parked in 53 then? 
<laughs> Why? I know where it is now. Okay. <laughs> No, it's not right, is it? It's um We've got to go back. It's this one, I think. It's behind you. Oh fucking hell. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you know I do this deliberately just to just to spice things up, you know that, you know that. Right, okay. It's this one, I think. Right, we've got we've got someone sitting over there, and that's fifty three. <laughs> that's back where we started. So we're over here, I think. Yeah, we're over here with Mark. Yeah, it's over here. I don't know what the issue is here. I think user error. Left a bit, right a bit, to me, to you. Yeah, that's it. It's only a small field, isn't it? Yeah, all right, Kim, go flying around. There is a speed limit here. Beautiful, Lewis. Yeah, look, it's lovely. Look. Right, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Jason. There we go. It's lovely. Oh, it's already on. There we go. Look, it's doing it. It's doing it. Well, should go ra all, all around the outside. Oh, we got there in the end. Bloody hell. Now, this isn't a very wide um, thing, is it? Well, Lewis, he's straight in there, isn't he? He's straight in there. I have to start calling you Lee. Have I just been hijacked by a tree? Yeah, I have. I suppose I could put the pipe in, couldn't I? While I'm doing this bit. That only actually needs to go out once we're... Um oh, that looks cool out there. This first person job? Bloody hell, this is awesome. One step ahead of you, Kim. Yeah, these TV screens in there. Oh, sold vehicles. Look, top right. You can't see it because it's behind me. That's got to be Joseph's tracksuit. Uh, tracksuit? <laughs> Joseph, we've sold your tracksuit and your Power Ranger slippers. Sorry. Sorry, mate. Yeah, we sold your tractor, Joseph. That's Mark doing that. Guarantee that's Mark. Guarantee it. <laughs> he loved that Adidas tracking. Yeah, but it was last year's model. He, he, he knew it. We knew it. All his mates knew it. Not yet, Lewis. Bloody hell, he's straight in there, isn't he? Not yet, give him a chance. Yeah, very different experience. Always first person, very different. Yeah, it's a sore subject, yeah. <laughs> Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. 
it's all good. It's all under control, isn't it, Joseph? He's, he's got a plan, and he's sticking to it. Oh, more sold vehicles. That's alright, Wookie. Still a lovely place. Beautiful Polpero. Oh, lizard. Oh, lovely. Beautiful. Polpero's got a little bit of uh, like a Venice feel to it. I don't know whether you feel that as you live there. Oh, really nice. Really a lovely little back streets. And the pasties down there. Sarah's pasties in Polpero. <gasps> They're literally making it in front of you. Some of the best pasties I've ever had. Everywhere you go, like in London, all you can smell is hash. In Cornwall, all you can smell is um, Cornish pasties. It's the difference, isn't it? It is the difference. <laughs> Maybe Lewis. <laughs> no, Joseph's all right. Leave him alone. Don't don't bully him. He's all right. He's all right, Mark. He's not uncalm. What's the opposite of calm? Uncalm. <laughs> this is really cool. Love it. Thank you for joining me tonight. Anyway, it's been nice, hasn't it? What? Tell me what you've been doing um, in the in the background. What you've been doing? I know you haven't just been watching thoroughly. I know you've been doing other things and that's good. I like that. What have you been doing? Tell me. Yeah, sounds a touchy subject there, Lee. <laughs> she definitely hasn't got it. <laughs> Don't mention the OCD. I mentioned it once. And <laughs> <laughs> You've been off work for 11 years now. What are you talking about, Lewis? Oh, bloody hell. Coming in here with his bloody... Oh, have you got a job here? What do you mean? Well, you've been unemployed for 11 years. Bloody hell. They'd have, they'd have invented other jobs in that time. Catch my niece up. What level-wise? Retired at 21, bloody hell. Did you make all the Bunsen burner? Did you uh, Did you have a nice little burner? Even the fridge is organised. We've all got OCD to a certain extent, but it's not real OCD, is it? OCD can be, like, real OCD. Um, can be crippling, can't it? I know we all joke about it, don't we? Oh, that picture's not straight. Oh, me OCD. But actually, OCD can be... A terrible, terrible infliction. I watched a program a little bit, um, a little while ago. It was on YouTube, actually. I think mean, it was an old program. This poor bloke. Um, it was more than OCD. But he had to he had to tap everything. And he had to get everything right. Because otherwise he felt that he was in danger. And he knew he wasn't. But he, his mind told him that he was in danger. Um of attack of some sort. He, he didn't really know, but he had this this feeling that he was in danger and he had to make sure he had to put it back and, and, and tap so many times and if he was distracted, he would have to take it all down and put it back up. Oh, terrible. You know, that that's OCD, isn't it? Not what, what we say. Like when you're building something in, say, um, Conan, you go, oh, it's triggering me OCD. It's not, is it? It's not. Because it can be so difficult. I think this bloke had to count to a certain number and tap everything to a certain number and if he lost count well that's it that's it should have enough room this is why I'm going around clockwise because my pipe out is on the left so in a minute 
Um, if someone wants to come and empty mix, I'm 64%. Yeah, exactly, Lee. That, that we all joke about it, but that's proper, isn't it? If she sees anything red, she thinks it's blood and freaks out. Bloody hell. Yeah, terrible afflictions that normal people that haven't got it. I don't mean normal, abnormal, but you know what I mean? People that don't experience it wouldn't understand. Wouldn't understand. The brain is a, um, well, it's his own worst enemy sometimes, isn't it? Oh, this is so cool doing it in first person. The whole time, look, we haven't even swapped to third person, have we? And yet, not, I never play like this, so it feels like a very, very different experience. Really cool. Right, how much room have I got, though? Yeah, so I can put that out, and then you can come and take it as you wish, then. Yeah. Yeah, feel free to... Um, oh, I think you already are, because it's going down. Let's have a look. Yeah, look at that. Awesome. It's definitely elevated the sim experience for me. I'll straighten some of these lines up now, so we're not always going on a curve. See, now I miss being third person to show you, but it's fine. We can see what's going on, can't we? Oh, do you really, George? I think we... Have we got any John Deere stuff? I'm sure we probably have. That's it, he's slightly ahead so we can see what he's doing. Cool. Yeah, I took a picture next to that um, lifeboat housing. 1904, I think it was stamped on the front. Real nice, lovely little building sticking right out into the water, obviously. We sat on that wall there, probably for about 45 minutes, just looking out to see. It was really nice. Oh god, that's a bit of a, a healthy um, turning circle. Let's straighten up some of these lines rather than going on curves. Yeah, what you been doing? I saw someone put hell divers. Tell me what you've been doing. Or did you all type that and I missed that because I was I was chatting about something else. Look at that light in and the shadow and it's so cool, isn't it? Uh, Jason, can you tell Para, uh, I have a, I have a trailer, please. His harvester is all, is already empty. Okay, cool. Para, you know what to do. Can you imagine being a farmer and like you've invested in this, uh, machinery and you pull it out to the field because everything's ready and you know there's a nice healthy bit of profit here. And something on this bloody machine just breaks and they can't get to you, you know, for another week or he comes straight out and tells you you need a part. It'd be so annoying, wouldn't it? So annoying. All right, Joseph, you don't need to join in as well. Bloody hell.
Also, Moza are going to be bringing out the um, stalk kit soon as well, with the high beam and the headlights. That's going to be cool. Yeah, I'm just going to go straight across, save this bloody... Um, silly bloody go-kart course I've created. <laughs> Boring great-grandparents. Oh, what, you still think that now? I bet they were lovely. You were just too young to understand, Wookie. So if he, w if he worked in the um, li uh, the uh, lifeboat for that long, there must be documentation and all that about him, Wookie. Whoa. Yeah, shame. Are they doing any uh, graphical stuff, or is it um, just a new area and, and bits? It really is, Lee, yeah. yeah. And I think going first person, it just it shows it up a bit more, how, how nice it is, I think. I think it actually looks better, but then I miss looking at the machinery. It's a weird one. But I love that. Look, it feels like I've been teleported straight into the actual machinery and it all looks look, it looks fantastic but at the same time I miss just looking at all the wheels the tyres, all the stuff working, I think this is a nicer way to play it, without a doubt it is immersive, yeah Well, I imagine in the old days, Pug, a lot of um, crew lost their life purely because they wasn't properly equipped. Now they've got to look after people so much, haven't they? And it's a vol is it a volunteer job or is it a paid job? Imagine volunteer volunteering for something that you could possibly lose your own life saving someone else's. It's crazy, isn't it? Oh, okay. Oh, okay, Shane. I'm up for anything that does better graphics on that. I mean, the graphics are nice, there's nothing wrong with them, but, yeah. Anything that can improve that game beyond what it already is, fantastic. Yeah, it's definitely immersive like this. I'm going to put my beacon on. See, I've set all that up on the steering wheel, along with indicators, <laughs> which I don't think we need. Got lights on here. Uh, I can press this. Got a uh, beacon on that. Cool. When we was at the Lizard, there was a helicopter flying around. I don't know whether he was on a like a um, training exercise, but he was flying all up and down a certain area of the um, of the coast, and because it was really rough. And of course, you know what it's like these days. People have got to get that selfie in. Fucking hell! Some people are going to the edge of the cliffs and all that. Seriously, stop it! They've got to get that. That one and only selfie, haven't they, to share to their friends who will never look at it. <laughs> oh, John's on holiday again. Great. He sent me another fucking selfie. Oh, look, he's just fell off the cliff. It's crazy. That's it. Right, we should have straightened these um, edges up a little bit. I think the game actually looks better from first person view, doesn't it? Well, 
When's that update coming out, Shane? It does, yeah, just the way the crops work and they're all sort of moving in the wind and the, the dirt and the mud. It's cool. The way the dirt and the dust collects on all the machinery. I mean, it's more than you could wish for, really, isn't it? Let's be honest. It really is. Yeah, it was a rescue helicopter and it was just going up and down. We was having our lunch at there's a restaurant in the Lizard, isn't there? Where you can sort of eat outside on a balcony and uh, just just watch the world go by. And that, that was really nice. I was like, you got any tables out the front? And it was it was a nice day. It was it wasn't like blistering, but it was just a little bit of warmth. And they're like, Yeah, we got a table. I was like, Oh, the result. Really nice food as well. doing the business as we go round probably <laughs> so I will finish once we finish this um, field which will probably be about another 20 minutes Yeah, there's some lovely campsites down there as well. We stayed at a different campsite each night in the old motor home that we hired. It was really cool. Even managed to do some modelling down there. I took my uh, box of tricks, I call it. <laughs> Chuck all my paints and models and stuff in there. Sit in the old caravan. On one of the nights, there was a storm. It even had a name. I can't remember the name of the storm. It actually felt like we was being driven along. We were laying in bed, and it felt like you were being driven along in the van. That's how that's how windy it was. Oh, it was crazy. And the rain, just relentless all night long. Fucking Lionel Richie would have been proud. And transfer to night attire for the like you're in your jimmies, aren't you, Colonel? That's what you're doing. <laughs> yeah, see you later, Mortz. Have a have a nice day, mate. Yeah, I'm gonna go when we finish this field. I've really enjoyed tonight though. And this has sort of enhanced my enjoyment sitting up here in the old um, in the old rig with the old steering wheel beautiful so thank you very much for joining me if you are going to go in a minute if not stick around to the end there might be a surprise there won't be a surprise <laughs> it'll just be more harvesting okay we're back on the farm though and like the farm hasn't gone anywhere i'll still keep it i like it you're in your bed pants i've always called them jimmies don't know why i'll be like go on kids get in your jimmies Nowadays, especially where I live, it's like, getting your kids jimmies, we're going shopping. <laughs> getting your jimmies, we're going to Asda's. next Saturday we're streaming is it the 20th next Saturday we've got um I racing event me Matt Max and Elgarth are doing a three hour endurance like driver swap thing uh, we're not driving simultaneously we're all taking turns in the same car uh, that's going to be really cool I need to just start doing some practice
but it's getting more and more dirty as we go. Well, I'll call them Jimmy's. Colonel probably calls them Frillies. Uh, Le Mans 24 hours, Shane. But it's it's going to be double hard. It's at night and it's in the rain. It's, you can barely see anything. It's a proper tricky, it's a proper challenge. It really is. Yeah, a proper challenge. It's going to be difficult. I think for my stint, because I've got quite a glossy TV, I think they're a lot more, this is quite an old TV, it's a Samsung, but it's a, a 40 inch, but I think they went through a phase of making their TVs quite glossy, didn't they? Well, this is a glossy one. So like with my little lightsaber thing on behind me and the lights above, it's really reflective. Now sitting here, playing this, it doesn't make any difference. But when you're basically driving on a black screen, that's essentially what it is. Um, I think what I'll do is for my stint, because we're, we're doing 40 minute, um, 40 minute stints. I think for once, and as a one only, because the other lads will be in chat anyway, I think I'm going to turn my chat window off and turn all the lights off and do it in the dark. They'll still be chatting to chat, and if there's anything you want me to say or hear, I'll, I'll get the message. But I think for that particular one, um, I think I'm going to turn the chat and the lights off as well. I'm sure you won't mind that. The thing is, with a three hour endurance, you've got other people's, like Matt's practicing, Max is practicing, so you've got their time in your hands, haven't you? If I don't put the time and effort in and the concentration, all the hard work that they do is then on me and I throw it away. So there's a lot of responsibility on that, really. You don't want to just go, oh yeah, oh I'm chatting, oh, oh I'm sorry lads, I crashed. They're like, for fuck's sake, I've worked a week on this, or two weeks on this. So I think on that particular one, chat will go off for my stint. And obviously on the rest of the three hours, um, we'll be spectating and seeing what's going on and being pit crew for them. Yeah, Mark's still there. Thank you, Mark. He's been a good lad tonight. Exactly, Shane. It's like I can't even laugh about it. Oh, oh! I was chatting and I come off down the straight. I think I'm turned the, the chat off. It won't matter, will it? You won't mind. Yeah, I love the driver swaps. It's so cool. And I racing is just awesome. Especially in the rain, they've got the best rain model. Oh my god. So good. <laughs> Five for a month, Colonel. <laughs> there you go. There's your member stream. There's your, there's your winning ticket. <laughs> Cheeky kid. We need to have a, um, a Zoom meeting actually soon, don't we? Because that's always fun. We're driving the Porsche um, uh, 911 GT3, 992, yeah, lovely car, sounds fucking gorgeous. And it's literally driver swap as you know, but for those that don't, it's a, like a proper driver swap. Um, there's, only, uh, there's only one car between us, so you pass the damage, the tyre wear, the fuel wear. <laughs> everything on to the next person do you still allow members to play this yeah it is a members um uh farm yeah yeah we did that just for a bit of peace and quiet really because just to open it to anyone you know especially after all the hard work that kim and mark and everybody else did and it was like yeah come in randoms just come in and chuck everything everywhere and then log out anonymously I suppose it was too much to ask wasn't it and it was like herding cats and they were spending so much bloody time trying to sort things out 
Now, in the end, I just put it back to members only. Then I didn't stream it for a little while. Everyone forgot about it. Now, no one's really mentioned it. It's cool. It's fine. And I do try to give members as much perkage as I can. <laughs> and it's only a small perk, obviously, but it means that you've got a farm to work on if you want it. What are you playing at the moment, Lee? T.com. Well, we've made money tonight anyway. The money's gone up. You love a perk, yeah. Yeah, as always, though, thank you for coming in, everyone. Oh, do you still only allow members to play this? Yeah, I see what you're saying. Yes, it is a members only. Yeah. I misread that. power has been doing contracts. He's been earning the bread. That's it. It's uh, contract on field 71 is 70% complete. ACC and WRC. Oh, nice. Yeah, I'll be playing WRC um, absolutely very soon. Once the old VR mod comes out. You got VR, Lee? Coming back, um, Mark. Just trying to clear these bloody edges. What? What have I done? <laughs> How did that happen? Right, just bloody straighten it up, for goodness' sake. Yeah. yeah. That is one scary game in VR. Bloody hell. Yeah, and I'm going back to like Dirt Dirt 2. Dirt 1? Dirt 2? Yeah, Dirt, Dirt Rally 2 in VR. I used to play it. Oh! That's total immersion. That really is. some pretty shapes of this field, haven't I? Yeah, Dirt Rally 2 is still good, isn't it? I mean, there's a lot of people not happy with WRC, but I don't really see anything wrong with it, to be honest with you. I like it, it's cool. It didn't get the best thing, did it? And a lot of people saying, oh, why make that when you got Dirt Rally 2? But, I don't know, it all, it all seems good. Maybe I haven't got a big uh, sort of rally requirement, but I'll start doing some more club events as well because that started going well. Usual thing, I'll drop it, don't I? <laughs> Fucker, don't I? Bloody hell, I've made a meal out of this, haven't I? Well, for this game, Shane, yeah, I saw there is some new DLC. I don't know what that's all about. And I suppose we'll, uh, we'll install it. That was the other thing. Because we were trying to open the farm to everybody, we kept things like DLC out. At least now, being members only, we can ask the people that are playing, look, have you got this DLC? Because if so, we'll chuck it in. Nice stitching.
Yeah, I did play that. I mean, there is quite a bit of a AC, a set of Corsa on the channel, actually. Um, I've got the Moza R16 uh, Kiwi. Yeah, I don't know. It's just something about it never, never bit, really. Hello, Chris. How are you? How's uh, how's life with you, Chris? We're on the steering wheel today, Chris. First person. It's been really nice. Really cool. Very different experience. Quieter as well, because it's usually a bit noisier out right? here. Yeah. But I'm actually taking you on the job itself. Binging Fallout, yeah. Are they all out now, or is it just a couple of episodes? R5, nice. It's good stuff, the Moza, isn't it, Kiwi? I like it, I'm very impressed with it. Extremely impressed. Pretty much got the full setup now. I've got a, a handbrake. Um, just sitting up there to swap over the Sparco handbrake. And then I will have everything Moser. Dropped all episodes. Oh, nice. One day early. Cool. It would be. Unfortunately, it probably wouldn't be with this particular setup. You know, it wouldn't like be a backwards compatibility thing, which is a shame for the, those that have already uh, invested, I suppose. Is Moser a new company? A couple of years old, I think. They've been on the market a couple of years. I'm sure they'll say they're probably way older than that, but I think they've been like good, uh, availability good for a couple of years. It's very, very nice stuff, Shane. Very nice. Build quality is good. The pit house software is really good. Yeah, it's all, it's all, it's all positive. Yeah. And obviously quite a big upgrade for me because the DD Pro is 8 newton meters. This is 16, so it's crazy powerful. Actually hurts my arms after a while. Not on this, I've got it quite light. And obviously on a bigger wheel, you will take out a lot of that strength anyway. Just by the very nature of what it is. Oh, there's nothing wrong with Fanatec. No, 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 no. And when AC... Oh, sorry, Mark. And when ACC comes out on console, um, I'll be swapping back over to... You know, the Nautschleifer. I'll be swapping back over to Fanatec. Which I'll be rotating anyway. Yeah, good service. Great reviews. Yeah. A sort of positive company, no, really nice people to speak to and deal with. I know I'm doing that from a sort of YouTuber type aspect, but you know, really nice people to talk to. Right, we're nearly done. Nearly done, love. So that huge wheel would be perfect for truck and farm sims. Yes, absolutely. Anything that's vehicular, like this ain't going to have, this, this particular machinery here isn't going to have a small wheel. It's going to have a, a proper wheel. Yeah, and it works really very well. Of course, you could do the same with a normal wheel. It's not doing anything a normal sim racing wheel wouldn't, apart from just more immersion, I suppose. And these buttons and the different colours that you can set are really nice. Like I've got the indicator set to an indicator colour and the high beam set to a high beam colour. It's nice, and they're bringing out indicator stalks very soon as well, which is, um, you know, it's a, it's a way to grab people's attentions, though, isn't it? You know, doing things like trucking and indicator stalks. You know, there's plenty of other firms that could have done that years ago, and they've come straight in and gone, all right, we'll do it. That's why I put that camera on, actually, just to give you an idea of the size and... You end up driving it just like a normal thing. You're not always like that because it's your sim racing setup. 
Do it like a like you would your truck or your car. Yeah, I always have my trucking and farming like this. Pretty pretty low level in terms of force feedback. I don't I don't want to be fighting with this. But obviously when you've got sim racing you can see it's completely got the power that you need. I don't think I'm gonna get much more immersion than what I've got already fighting with the steering wheel for false feedback. I, I like it quite light really. Right, we might be on our last run. No. Not bloody likely. Yeah, this is literally quite light false feedback, but that's fine. I like it like that. Exactly, Lee, that's the difference, yeah. A lot of them are power steering. Yeah, you probably, you know, I know it's got a, a knob on it, but you'd probably be able to do this with your finger, wouldn't you, like you can now? Look at that tractor. Just the, look at it. It looks real, doesn't it? So cool. What an accomplishment. It's a bit like how I feel about trucking, you know, as a game. It's such an accomplished game. This is this is crazy good. If you like your vehicles and your your reality and your immersion, this is so spot on, isn't it? <laughs> Chris. Don't start Lee off. We're never at the end of it. The lighting as well. Look at that shadowing. Video games, eh? Yeah, total change for me, Lee. And I haven't sort of kept flicking back because I can't get used to it. It's um, quite easy to get used to. Oh, that was it. I thought there was a bit more. Yeah, cool. Right, I've just got this little bit down here to do. This little landing strip down here. <laughs> Thank you for your help, uh, Mark, and Kim, and Power, and everyone else that come onto the farm. I'm going to shoot off after this, but there will be more towels from the farm <laughs> very soon. I was talking to Kim actually about maybe saving this farm, um, you know, as a save file, and whack another farm in there to keep the interest going, and maybe rotating them every couple of months, go back to this, load the save up, but. I don't know. I don't know. We'll have to ask members what they think. <laughs> Brazilian. Nice little landing patch, isn't it? Lovely. Oh, lovely. That's lovely, that is. There's always that awkward bit you can't get to, though. This actually took quite a while for a, a relatively small field. <laughs> no, Chris. That's all right. Thank you very much, Sophie. Don't forget you're a member now again, so you can come into the farm if you want. Details all in the members' room. There you go. If you empty out this last bit, um, Mark. Is he here? Yeah, he is here. I can hear it. No, I can't. I can't see him either. Alright, let's, um, let's fold that up.
Good night, George. Let's fold it. Pull that in. Oh no, no, it's not. It's um another young lady. I can't remember her name, Kim. What was her name that was helping on the farm? Uh yeah, sorry, Sophie, I got mixed up. Right, whereabouts are we in terms of uh we're down there. Don't keep doing that. Where's our farm? It's here, isn't it? Jody, that's it, yeah, sorry, I got totally mixed up then. Um, Mark, can I follow you to the farm? I don't know where I'm going. Can't remember. Or I'll just leave it here. But I've got 2% in me. Right, I'm here, aren't I? That's it. Okay. Okay. Just go over to the right. Let's take a shortcut. They won't mind. There we go. Here's our farm up here. <laughs> Colonel! For goodness sake, Colonel. You just can't be trusted. And you're in your pyjamas as well. Which, for some reason, makes it feel wronger. <laughs> oh. Driving over the little new seedlings. Here's Mark. Let me get me let me get me thing out. Uh, I need to unfold it, don't I? Yeah, I've got two percent here. Yeah. yeah, you think he's in his jimmies. He's not, is he? That's why I'm coming to you, Mark. Coming to you. Coming to you, Mark. Coming to you. There we go. Chuck that 2% in. Bosh. <laughs> Keeping his ankles warm. Oh, he's got lovely warm ankles. Right, I'll follow you, Mark, because I don't know where we're storing this, all right? I imagine Colonel to be wearing a night dress similar to what George Cole wore in um, a Christmas, um, what's it called, a Christmas, you know, where the ghosts come and with the hat and a proper night dress, you know, that's what I'm imagining the Colonel in. No, I'm not imagining it, I'm just saying. Right, we still got the jet wash here? Yeah, we have. Christmas Carol, is it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Christmas. Mm. I'm sorting that shed. Okay, that's fine. Right, let's clean this. Always got to do it. Always got to lead by example, apparently. You know, we want it done, and that's what we've got to, we've got to be seen to be doing ourselves. Why can't we be like politicians where we want things done, but we don't do it ourselves? So much easier. I mean, even this is a great little addition, isn't it? That you can wash your vehicles, because you know, they know what people are gonna ask for. Okay, you put dirt in there, can we wash it? Yes, and it all comes up pristine. anyone behind me I'm just sort of hit and hope really just suck it and see see what's happening right you mean down here didn't you in the shed down here I think that's where you mean put it down there I'm sure this is where it was actually oh I'll put it next to what you're doing actually yeah I'll put it there can you line it up next to all the other ones gotcha well, I'll line it up as straight as I can. How about that? Do 
I'd say that's pretty fucking perfect. Ish. Need another shed. Too many big things. Yeah, yeah. Well, do one. Do one here. Perfect. That was a good night, actually. I really enjoyed that. You feel like you put the, the time and effort in. Um, so thank you very much to everyone that joined the stream. As always, thank you to all the people that make the farm happen. That is it, everyone. Have a lovely weekend. Uh, if I don't see you tomorrow, I will try and stream in the afternoon. But if I don't see you, I'll see you next week. Back to normal. Um, have a lovely weekend. See you next time.